the Esoteric Order of Role Players present The Great Pendragon Campaign by Greg Stafford, with David Larkins as the Game Master. I was just thinking about it because okay. Scott got in his head to watch Point Break last night after uh, <laughs> after hearing Isn't apparently that you about do the sequel the or the, party? the remake. The remake, yeah. And so like we're watching Point Break last night and I'm, I'm sitting here eating my sandwich. and I'm like, you know, I'm I'm still kind of hungry. I should have done with the like, Gary Busey and you <laughs> talk at me. You talk. Can we do? Make it do. Make it do. You talk. <laughs> oh my god, that would be amazing. I, I yeah. Would Taven have gotten all of um, the gracing stuff? Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. So can I just um, transfer all of the equipment, the embellished parcel plate? Yeah, at least they did so. Absolutely. All that the metal mm -hmm. that he... I mean, if you want to wear the metal, that's, yeah, that's no. a little gauche, <laughs> but, you know, you would have it. Do you know the... Uh, yeah, we ended up watching Point Break. The wrestler, what's his name? Kurt Angle, I think? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. I had a picture taken with him when... Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, he, he tried to flirt with me, but I was like... Yeah. He, I know, it was gross. No. I was, I'm trying to think how old I was. Um, was he in, like, singlet mode, or was he in, like, evil clothes? No, he was wearing, like, you know, Normal city clothes. clothes. <laughs> 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 clothes. Yeah. Uh, I was, like, yeah, 19 or something. Oh, no. Like, gross. Wow. Hey, so what's your name? Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. Uh, so I also, okay, Ancient Bronze Sword. Oh, that's right. Plus two. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, that's Breaks on Why did I see Grecian? so rude. Well, he's dead now, so. Yeah. Wait, has he died? A, a, in a tournament, he died. In a, he died off screen in a tournament. No, <laughs> no, he died during. He died during the tournament that you wounded him in. Yeah. Yeah. So way right. to bring it up. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's right. It was the uh, was it the melee that took you? Okay. okay. Mm. All right. I think it was the melee. Yeah. Well. <gasps> that was hilarious. That was the first of many deaths at that session. Yeah. Yes, it was. That was a... It was a bloody session. Mm -hmm. That was a downer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well. All right. Moving along with so, Winter Phase. Okay, so... Oh, he's ready. Oh, then. All right. He's done. All right. Yay. Okay, yearly events. Oh. Whoa. Right. Fifteen. Fifteen. <laughs> That's an enemy. Oh, yep. Happening. All right. Oh, an enemy. D6. Yep. Another one? <laughs> you get another one. Wait, how many enemies do you have? Oh, so mm -hmm. many. Really? No, Aggravane. Four. Aggravane's a big one. I have four enemies. No, it's a, it's a four. Okay, what's your highest passion? Oh. Oh, man. That would be a more Lorette. Oh. Ooh, somebody has slated her. Oh, oh. shit, they're going to die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they will die. All right, D6 roll then. Let's see who it is. Five, please let it be aggravated. Yeah, well, they're equal to you. Mm. Yeah, wouldn't he be equal? What's your You're pretty high up there. Uh, 64, 35, not that high up there. Well, yeah. He's a round table knight, too, so. Right, right. Not quite equal. Um, not quite. Oh, well. And where? D6 roll. Been cool. Four. Hmm. At the king's court. Mm. Okay. Who is angry? D6 roll. It's aggravating squire. <laughs> I'm equal to aggravating squire? No, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that part. Five. Sorry. You hate each other. <laughs> oh. And how angry are you? Mutual oh. hate. Mm. One is the best. One is the best. That's right. Six. Oh, oh righteous animosity. Oh, oh. so it's, it's like, it's actually like a legitimate righteous? I mean. Well, you, you both feel like you're in the right. Ooh. So, oh, okay. Yeah. All right, that's it. Well, he probably hit on her. And exactly. you know, she's a she's an open she's a free entity. Okay. But at the same time, like I'm kind of secretly in love with her, so oh. there you go. Like, mm. there you yeah. Go. yeah. It's upsetting to you. Indeed. So who is he? Who is the cad? <laughs> <laughs> the cad. 
Mm. Let's see. Equal to you, so it wouldn't be around here tonight. Regrettably not. No. <laughs> <laughs> but he's at the king's court, so that's interesting. Let's see who's at the king's court who isn't around here tonight. Yeah. Well, Leander's safe then. Merlin? Or rather, I'm safe. <laughs> yes, yeah, you're Merlin. Safe from sorry, I just thought I'd bring him up. I'm <laughs> safe, Leander. You are. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Get another, get another home wrecking done by me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> <laughs> I really and truly wish, but no. It's not meant to be. Mm. Okay, it is uh, Sir Garyant, Prince of Strangora. Oh, Sir Garyant. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. That guy. Who else is he affiliated with? Um, just his family from, you know, he's the royal family of Strangora, so. Okay. Strangora. Mm-hmm. Hmm. It's time for someone to get strangled. Oh, no. oh okay. She we were all thinking right into it, that one. Yeah. but didn't want to say it. Mm-hmm. I just had to bring it out. Mm-hmm. That's okay. It's okay, Dig. You know, Dig's got to sing it. It's uh, it's sort of in his nature. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's do a yearly event for Leander. Oh, why did you do that right when I got up? Because <laughs> you always walk right from the table. During showtime, the know. spotlight hits you. Yeah, it was like just performance anxiety. Uh huh. Just walk it off. Walk it off. <laughs> Eight. Oh, 13. Oh, a saga event. Yeah. Really? Yeah, so roll a uh, d20. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Four. Mm. <gasps> oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh. Maybe I'll have some meaning in my life for once. Well, Aww. funny you should say that. A, oh. a prediction has been made. Oh, why did I go to a, why did I go to a soothsayer? I don't know. Why would I do something like that? Maybe it like was that? maybe it was involuntary. You maybe somebody predicted you. You got predicted on. Oh sure. Okay. So somebody it? has made a prediction mm-hmm. that you will one day go on a pilgrimage. <laughs> yeah right. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Uh huh. Am I going to start that, or...? (laughs) Whenever you like. That's just the prediction. Now it's up to you. Well, see, that's stupid. They planted a seed. So, of course, I'm going to be, like, thinking about it. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Uh Mm -hmm. So, slow year. Time for that pilgrimage. Yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. I'm sick of your guys' faces. Mm -hmm. I'm out of here. Et cetera. Mm All right. All right. D20 roll for Tathan. 19. Mm. Bad fortune. Oh, my God, no. Oh, that's right. High numbers are bad. <laughs> yeah, this, this chart messes with your mind. <laughs> All right, so another d20 roll, please. 17. Uh-oh. Ooh, oh, my. Uh, get in a fight or lose 2d6 Libra. Ooh. Fight, yeah. fight, 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 yeah. fight, 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 fight. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Fight. Fight. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So roll your Valorous. Is that Street Fighter or Mortal Kombat? I think that's... Both? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think it's Street Fighter, but I'm more 100%. <laughs> your opponent today will be Dalson. Uh, <laughs> All right. No, so <laughs> but there's stretchy arms. arms. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yoga flame. Oh, God. <laughs> it's a well-known ability of yoga to teach you how to breathe fire. Yeah. <laughs> uh, All right. So Valorous. Ah. Roll Valorous. Yes. Really? Oh, that's a fumble. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Ooh, dear. fumble, eh? Excellent. I mean, tough one. I don't have my backup character. Right? All right. Roll a weapon skill of your choice. Okay. Um, here. Okay. Eleven. <laughs> Can you made it? Passion? No. Oh, okay. All right, so you made that. And then roll horsemanship. Okay. Oh. Hey. Hey. Yep, made it. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> Great. So you actually uh, win the fight. Really? Oh. Yep. Woohoo. Despite yeah, the actually, fumble. Despite the fumbles. Oh. Despite the Valorous fumble, everything else just fell in the line. Ah. Yep. Okay. So that was a little skittish at first? Is that what that means? <laughs> yes, perhaps, yeah. He had to chase you around the castle before you chased him. <laughs> <laughs> just one lap. Just one. Just one. Yeah. Just one. Yeah. All right. Not too no. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, and then so yeah, you also picked up five Libra in goods. Nice. Ooh, cool. Mm-hmm. 
Well. See, instead of losing Libra, it'd be a game Libra. That's right. Yeah. But there's that awesome. fumble we have to deal with. Uh-oh. So roll a d6. Five. Hmm. Okay. Well, in the course of the fight, you picked up some kind of chronic pain injury. Oh, perhaps you torqued no. your back or sciatica, uh, sciatica yeah. perhaps. I don't Saddle know. source. So you lose, <laughs> no. you lose a point of your hit points permanently. <gasps> oh, I've got oh, that too. Oh, no. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so and... Uh, down to 27. Let me double check your numbers since you were adjusting okay. your attributes yeah. there. Okay. See, I'm all the way down to 24 from the... From rolling that way? Like... <laughs> <laughs> well, it happened to me once, so I was 25, and now I'm 24. Ah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright, that's fine. So this con is... Okay. Total hit points is size plus con. That's going to be 31, which Oops, will then nice. become 30. <laughs> that's Pretty better good. than the 28 I had written down. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Well, you boosted your... Uh, Size quite a bit. Size, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. that's right. Dang, I only had four hours of sleep. Just <laughs> to sorry. warn you. <laughs> I'm glad you can yeah. still come. Yeah. yeah I know. Okay. Yeah, both Desiree and Renee are operating on reduced sleep, so it should be an interesting like session. <laughs> mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, I don't foresee much of a difference. So. <laughs> 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 All right. So. <laughs> That's true. All right. So go ahead and roll your checks. Uh, I think we're done. Yeah, we're done. Oh, okay. Shit. Very good. Way ahead, EGM. Yep. All right. Aging roll for those of you 35 years of age or more. I'm 35. I'm 34 this year. Yeah. No. Ah, rolled an eight. That's a potential loss. That is one d six. When I roll two d six. Two d six and add together. Nine. Five. You got a five, so you're gonna lose a point of app. No. And a nine is also nine. one point. Okay. Or one one roll. One roll. Two. That's a point of dex. My dex is already eight. Seven. I I think I have arthritis. Probably yeah. Like, I, I can't move very well, and no. I don't know why. I've got a bum leg. Do you? Mm. Yeah. Either that or you just have gout from uh, eating too much meat and cheese. Mm. Dude, I'm not that much of a... I am actually fairly temperate, so... Oh, okay. I actually have arthritis, but I don't know what that is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like it just means that things are a little bit harder to accomplish now. Very difficult. You yeah. can't open jars the way you used to be able. Okay, you know what? <laughs> not funny. You can't invent and then open jars the way that you used to. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's true. Yeah. Damn it. I hate how limited my life is right now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright, everyone collects income from your manners. How mm. much? Well, two for you, I know that much. That I can spend on or lawn my Oh yeah. My hate crush. Of course, your hate crush. Let's go ahead and take care of that right now. Alright. I want to, yeah, get rid of her resistance. Mm-hmm. Rid of her resistance. Yes. If you don't mind, after Des, I'd like to jump into that um, circuit myself. Hate oh, crushes? Sure. <laughs> no, no, the, uh, oh. just the, uh, just the romance angle. Of oh. You have an amour in mind? Uh, yeah, Lorette. Lorette. Of course. After this year, how could I not? Yeah, yeah it's true. No, no, it's a big deal. It makes that, your feelings like even more obvious. guy sniffing around your skirt. Yeah, yeah exactly. Not good. He's, uh, he's letting me know exactly what my timetable looks like. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> timetable. All right, so <laughs> you spent a Libra. Yes, I did. Okay. Go ahead and roll 2d6. Mm, nine. Hmm. Ooh. Fight a boar without armor. Oh, wow. Whoa. Sure not without weapons. Like <laughs> yeah, just without, without armor. armor. Just gotta find a small boar. I do. Could be a baby boar. 
We'll, uh... Um, <laughs> his little piglet. We'll scare, <laughs> <one up. laughs> we'll scare one up for you. Yeah. No, what you do is you kill the you kill the piglet, and then you put it way up in the foreground, and then you stand back a ways. <laughs> you take a selfie. And then, and then have someone paint a picture of it. <laughs> and then paint a picture it of it and take it to Well, no, it's just on your tapestry. <laughs> it's on my tapestry. <laughs> like this giant board. It's like this wee little piglet. <laughs> wee! Wee! All right. The board looks kind of out of focus. No, no. It's totally no, really. Focus. That's totally, happened. That actually totally happened. Totally legit. All right, so what do She's I do? She's really furry. Yes, so we have to just the fuzz. Fuzz, fuzz fuzzy. Yeah. A fuzzy boar. All right, so you're off on a hunt. Yes, I am. Hold on, let me pull I'm up the streamlined solo hunt thing. I'm passionate the early with event my table. quote amour for her. Your quote amour. Oh, by the way, reduce that by one. So well, I'm not claiming it. <gasps> it's the appearance of the amour, so yeah, yeah, I would imagine that that's legal. But yes, you could totally imagine yeah. that. Yes, absolutely. It's more, more like my hate of her. So. I mean, you're still shouting it, but you're shouting it ironically now. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I hate you. Okay, I made it. All right, give me... All right, so that's going to uh, impassion your hunting, I suppose. Right, plus all 10 right. to my hunting. So roll your hunting. I uh, crit that. Wow, great. Okay, yeah. well, no no need for the streamlined rules then. That a crit on your hunt roll means you find the quarry right away. Mm. Oh, I just found it. Nice. No, I she need to kill it. It's a tiny one. It's a wee. Yeah. A wee boar. A wee boar. <laughs> All right, Aww. so it's like some kid's pet. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like have, it's like in somebody's backyard. I yeah. have kicked puppies in the past. You, you, are, you are literally known as a puppy kicker. Yeah. <laughs> it's, so. like a, it's like a half domesticated boy that you're just. Gonna <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's just a very hairy pig. Yeah. It's so squiggly. <laughs> So squiggly. And just tied on little fake tough. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Check this out. All right. <laughs> okay. Here we go. I'm a living joke. So you're fighting the boy. <laughs> yeah, I'm a living joke. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're fighting this boar then. Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Plus ten to my hunting, right? Or my oh, spear. You can do impassion again. You would need to impassion. Okay, again. my lance then. Yes. Um, so can I use the same one? Uh, you can use the same passion. Yes, it's not a battle. I. Fail, don't fail, don't fail. No, I cr- I made it. I almost created it. You almost created it. Yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. So great. All right, here we go. Yeah, well, at this point, you're at 19, right, I critted, on your passion? I my... Oh, okay. Yes. You're at 19 on your passion, right? Yes. So it's either succeed, crit, or fumble. That's right. Oh, that's yeah. fun. Uh-huh. That's it's, fun. Be, it's really fun. That's a nice danger zone. So fun. So, so fun. fun. Well, you still check it when you succeed at it, though, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you, uh, you critted, you critted mm-hmm. your attack. Okay. Mm-hmm. It critted its avoidance, actually. Oh, oh damn. Yeah. All right. All right, so we're going to go back to hunting. You're still in passion. Right. Go ahead and make a hunting roll. I make it. You made it. Succeeded. Oh, wow. Okay, now I fumbled its avoidance. Uh-oh. So, so you track Lance. it for about an hour. Mm-hmm. Uh, spear, actually. Spear? You track it yeah. for about an hour through uh, through field and, and dale and finally catch up with it again. So you may okay. attack again. I crit. Nice. Yes. I know. Right. Success trying to gore you, and I was one point away from critting as well. So uh, uh, go ahead. Well, I wasn't one point away from critting you. You were. Mm-hmm. I actually critted. Um, yes, you damage. Did. I can do my damage now. Mm-hmm. Yes, double damage. Mm-hmm. No. Oh God, that's abysmal. Okay. Why is this taking me so long? Unfortunately. Seven, thirty-five, thirty-nine, forty. I hope that wasn't too slow <coughs> in terms of my counting. No, I'm sure yeah. you're quite fine. You had to roll dice multiple times. Yeah. yeah. All right, forty. So, um, let's see. Okay, very good. So you did, you did forty points of damage to the boar. I did, but the oh, boars okay. are big, so. Yes, yes, they are. Here we go again. Here we go again. I made it. What'd you roll? Seated with a 14. Okay, that beats my 6. Regular damage. I know it. This time I'll be better at counting. Uh-huh. Eight, nine, <coughs> oh, God. 16. 16. Horrible. 16. All right, well, still enough to kill it, mm, but that, hey. of course, means it gets one more round. Right. So. Oh. Uh, I crit. 
Okay, it did not, so no need to roll damage. Wow, I so. wish she was here to see me, to witness me do this. Well, you can take back the tusks. I <laughs> will, but she never sees me dinner. doing something for you know. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Wait, if you're if you're up, if you're really trying to like you know spite her, why would you even follow it's the letter? Because it's gonna make it all the more sweeter mm. when it's she's like, like you did everything it. you could have. I'm like f you. Oh, uh, that's fair. You know. Well, I didn't want to say it in the moment, but your boar fight kind of reminded me of the end of Sir Care Bear. <laughs> Didn't want to jinx you. <laughs> oh, Care Bear. <laughs> I'm. <laughs> I've forgotten so much. <laughs> I really have. I, I've had it out of my mind. But thank you for that memory. Of good. course. Poor Care Bear. Okay, very good. So yeah. you uh, you completed the task. I did. Very Hopefully good. Hopefully she'll approve. She will. Oh, she will? Of course. Oh. You did completed it. the task. Yeah. Hmm. So let's see. You can reduce... Let's see, I'll call that a critical success since you, uh, you got it on the crit. Okay. So resi- um, resistance... What is it? Reluctance or resistance? Mm-hmm. It's a uh, reluctance factor. Reluctance factor is reduced by three. I'm back to square one. Back to single digits. Yeah, back where I was before. Mm. Back to single digits, y'all. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. <laughs> why? Why? <laughs> okay, so... Very good. I'm just making note of that. I wonder if she would do intrigue to see if I'm, like, legit. Because I'm not telling anybody. I'm keeping this to myself. She has peasants stalking her every move. Yeah, like, waiting me to, like, you know, flub up and say, like, Oh, I don't care about her. Or whatever. <laughs> That'll break her heart. I don't know. I don't think she likes me that much. <laughs> she's, I, I would imagine she's still under the influence of that love potion. Really? You're it's, giving me false hope here. This is not good. It's Faye. Hmm. I don't think that kind of thing goes away. No, it doesn't. Uh-oh. It doesn't have an expiration date. That stays with you. Wait, why was I mad at her in the first place? Um, because your resistance went up to, uh... <laughs> <laughs> got back up to ten from four. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And you were like, fuck this noise. Yeah, I got mad. Yeah. I did get mad. You felt like you were getting played. I, I did. Yeah. I don't know, we'll see. But why am I mad at her <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Okay. Okay, so as for Lorette... Yep. Yep. All you have to do is mm. make the declaration. You have an amour already, right? <laughs> I do. All right. I declare bankruptcy. Yeah. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm. And so she generates a reluctance factor equal to 20 plus one quarter of her chaste value Uh-oh. minus the value of her amour passion for the night, if any. She doesn't have one. All oh right. No. Oh, this is this is a hopeless thing for for Dick, but you know <laughs> he's gonna milk it for all the glory <laughs> that he can. Can I right. away from that? So her, uh... If you want. Okay, yes? Mm. Well, it's, uh, you either get glory or you... Or yeah, you get glory. Yeah, so, I, I, no, so her chase is 12. Chase is 12, so quarter of that is 3. 3. Yep. So her RF is 23. Oh, man. Okay. 23? Yeah. Did she even look at you? No. <laughs> she, uh, she, she, she knows saved, who you are. She saved my life once. Oh. True, she did. Yeah, yeah, well, she that's, does. that's how I generated that anymore. Right. right. Yeah. Of 27. Damn. Oh! Ooh. This is so, damn. I've got a torch. <laughs> you yeah. Buried that, you buried that pretty deeply, and though. I've been, yeah. I, it was buried, but it is you resurfaced. But then it resurfaced. Oh, yeah. God. All right. Wow. So, Whoa, uh, you, have to, you have to Inflate, present her with a gift yeah. worth one Libra. To Actually, care. it says at least one Libra, but oh. you don't get anything else if it's higher than that. So. Well, you know, I, I don't actually have a manor, so... Oh, oh well, so one Libra so one sacrifice Libra. for you. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> it's okay, I can do this for 16 more years. Excellent. <laughs> then make it a more roll. <laughs> yep, I make it. Very good. And then roll 2d6. Mm-hmm. Uh, nine. Whoa. Nine, okay. Resistance increases by... Oh, oh <laughs> damn it. Okay, create an original love poem at court, which is oh, a composed that's easy role. for you. Mm-hmm. Dude, so you have all the courtly skills. Amour, obviously I'm passionate with Amour. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I think I actually crit the Amour. Yeah. God. Yeah. It's wow. Really dangerous. This is good. 28. That's yeah. all right. It's okay. I, I promise to only use this for good. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, huh. Uh-huh. Okay, I quit the, uh, yes. I quit the compose. Great. Dude, All right, so critical, her RF is reduced by three, or... What? 
you may reap glory. You don't get any bonus for critting, though. Hmm. No. I'll, uh, I'll reduce your RF by three. Yeah. It's so tempting, isn't it? Well, you know, it's it's three years worth of uh, worth of regular successes. That's right. That's right. Dude, it's totally... Dude, you have, like, all those, like, courtly skills, so she's totally gonna... I don't know. Remember years where you had to win... <laughs> win be the grand champion of a tournament? <laughs> I haven't even look, won a tournament look, 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 yet. Look. <laughs> I'm only good at great sword, cutting people's heads off, and um, what else am I good at? I'm good at... Screwing like, your friend's wife. Trusting, <laughs> trusting yeah. people and... <laughs> and I have a lot of energy, so I'm not necessarily like. Yes, you do have a lot of energy. That's true. <laughs> 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 and I walk around like I in a lot of pain all the time because my arthritis. Oh, I thought you were gonna say from your permanent erection. <laughs> <All right. laughs> no. Oh God, that's oh. that the death penalty. <laughs> no, it is the death penalty. I'm a pre-penalty. I'm a. That's my problem. It's the constant waddle. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you had a low dex to begin with. <laughs> I reject that totally. Are there any hide pieces? <laughs> no, not yet. Um, not yeah. quite yet. They're, not yet. they're oh, coming okay. in very soon. Sir Leander's going to be the... Uh, yeah, I'll invent yeah. <laughs> yeah, actually, he didn't invent the cod piece. It's just the hemlines got high enough that people could... Oh, yeah. <laughs> just started, they're like, what have you done? It's like, what? It's just, this it's is what package. I'm rocking. It's my package. That's right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Very unusual. And yes, in this in this uh, uh, continuity, they're known as Leanders. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So. I hate you guys. <laughs> That's hilarious, actually. Okay. Still. <laughs> Very good. So stable rolls, horse survival. I'm laughing way too much of that. All right. Um, okay. Cool. Destry lives. Yay. Oh wow! Is this annual income look? Like Everyone lives. Oh, one of my chargers dies. Oh no. Size grand. And there's the wishing well. Oh yeah. And I have to um. Is it deceitful? I have to make. Discretionary. Uh, oh, the 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 wishing well was actually at Gratian's uh, manor. Ah. Okay. Yes. So, so you're fine off. there. You've got 18 libra improvements from Stelzer. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna change that. Because the. Um, what happens is whenever whenever a manor changes hands, the tax assessors come by and do oh. a new assessment. Okay. <laughs> it's so much like real life. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and um, yeah, so. Then you get stiffed. And then you get stiffed. Mm. Or Leander. Do I get Leander? Yeah. <laughs> <You> get Leander. <laughs> so the good news is, because your income is, has been so uh, so much improved by the improvements, uh, you have four household knights at your disposal. Oh, yay! Cool. Yeah. There you go. So it's Thank a discretionary you. of four per year. Nice. Still pretty good. Yeah. Okay. And then a knight that I can add. Okay. Glory. Hmm. Glory. Not, well, we're almost there. Oh, God damn. All right. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Anyone looking to get married this year? No. No. Courting. Mm. Courting? Okay. Really? Okay. Um, children? <laughs> No. Oh, no. Oh yeah, I do have a kid, don't I? I? Oh. I, I had that one kid with my wife last year. Oh, okay. Yes, go ahead and see how Lady Anne. The daughter, I think it was. Does this year. Yes, Tanry, mm-hmm. the daughter. Yeah. But she's being kept at a uh, at a rich level because she's the uh, at the castle, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Oh shit. Well, I rolled a one. <laughs> <laughs> well. That won't help you. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> well, well, sir. Oh, what the hell happened? She fell out of a window or something? Probably. She, uh, yeah. It's horrible. Mm, fell into a, a vat of rendering fat, maybe. Ew! Yeah. These things happen. What? One of Benjamin Franklin's siblings died that way. Really? Yeah. That's horrifying. Yeah, because his father's like a tanner or a Yeah, I didn't know that much. Yeah, yeah. He, I think he was a tanner. Yeah, so one of the kids oh, drowned in a, in a vat of melted fat. Oh, God. That's so sad. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the discovery of that? Horrifying. Yeah. Mm. I read about it in a kid's book, and so they illustrated it with, like, no. a pair of feet sticking out of the vat. 
Was the author, was the illustrator oh like influenced by Edward Gorey or something? Pretty much. Like it was like from the 70s, so you oh, know. Man. It was that period of really oh, fucked up kids' books. Yeah, yeah. drug induced children's books. The wow. illustrators of those kids' books were. Yeah, oh, they're really, the really dark humor. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So, Renee, what'd you roll for Lady Anne? 17. 17 is a child. Yay. Mm-hmm. Wow. So, well, roll a d6 to, to discover. <laughs> Gross. The gender. That would be a son. A son. Oh. All right. Good job. Come on, I think that's good luck. Mm-hmm. I love that. That's great. Mm-hmm. I have no heirs to speak of, but. Wait, is, uh, is Leander yeah. still. Um, I don't know. It's up to Leander. No. What are you talking about? Could, she got too attached. You could be. That could be your heir. She got no. too clingy. No. <laughs> she got. She did get too clingy. Right. Who knows? It may be my heir. It may not be. Oh if they God. have deep set eyes and they feel at home in nature, you'll know it's my child. <laughs> <laughs> if they grow to seven feet tall. That too. Oh, uh, that whole thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, um, um. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's do some kin events. D6 roll. That'd be hilarious if you decided to do that. <laughs> uh, none for me. Okay. And. Well, what did I do? D6, uh, D6 roll. roll. Oh, yeah. What did I what do? What did you know? Five. I would have had to roll for that with great kin. I know. Exactly. Five. Yes. It's, yeah. yeah. So that's a uh, one kin event for you. So what D20 roll, please? Oh, thank okay. Three. 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 Uh, okay. So you've had a sibling wed above their stature, so you gain one kin knight. Roll d6. Oh. Six. Oh. <laughs> one kin knight. Uh, <coughs> that's going to be an old knight. So you gain an old knight. What? <laughs> I'm an old knight. Mm, you're still middle-aged, actually. Old knight. Damn it. Mm-hmm. Okay. And a d6 for Kathan. Yes. Three. Three is none. Yeah. Okay. okay. <coughs> All right. So family events. All right. Training and practice. All right. Training and practice. So Renee, just I can no longer reminder. Add, oh, uh, you can add D six plus one amongst your skills under fifteen. You can train a skill over fifteen up by one point, maximum twenty. Mm-hmm. And that's right. You're over thirty five, you so you stats. can't can't touch your stats. Oh. Or you can raise a trait or passion by one point, maximum twenty. Okay. All right. Um, dude. Wow. <coughs> Can I raise my sword? One? Yeah. What's your sword at? Fifteen. Yes. Absolutely. No. Okay. Raise up to sixteen. Yay. Make that sword sixty. That's right. All right. All right. Le gloire. Yeah. Uh. Okay. So, any point in handing out Sir Ewain's glory? I don't even think he's. Did he have any offspring or anything? Uh, no. And he's not even going to go on Obsidian Portal, so there's no purpose. Aww. Well, just for the record, he, he earned 37 points of glory <laughs> in his brief time. He ended up with less than 3,000 glory. Oh. Poor Sir. Yikes. All right. Dig, on the other hand, before his near mortal wounding, picked Indeed. up 330 points. Woo! Yeah. Leander right. got 387. What? And Tathan racked up a healthy 805. Woo! Wow. What? Uh-huh. Well, That's between the marriage great. and yeah, uh, no, that's tournament. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Yay. So what's his total then? Um, oh, yeah. So what's Concord's uh, glory? Yeah. Concord's? Yeah. 1294. It was not very high. 1294. <laughs> well, really? Yeah. That's, that's surprising. I was, uh, I think I was doing something wrong with him. Yeah, Uh-oh. I'd say. What were you doing to <laughs> What were you doing to Concord? Yeah. Yeah, that can't be right. Oh! I scratched out here uh, 9,831. Yeah, that sounds that a lot more uh, Because I'm looking back to my... 44. I'm looking back to my records. One year alone, you you racked up 1,357 no. glory. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I mean... It shows here. I mean, already like three thousand and eight on your go- on your running tally. So <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. We'll go with the nine thousand. That sounds reasonable. Yeah. Okay. Ninety eight thirty one. Ninety eight thirty one. All right. Sweet. All right. So, so yeah. Tathan started with nine eighty three. He got knighted for another thousand, and then eight hundred and five takes you to twenty seven ish. Yeah. Twenty seven eighty eight. Twenty seven eighty eight is his total. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. 
Oh, it's a lot of mapping. So that'll give you um, <laughs> that'll give you a thousand thresholds. So you'll get a point to put somewhere. Yeah. Well, two technically. Oh. That's right. Uh-huh. The other. Are we getting new armor yet? I mean, you you had the the fancy armor that uh, the queen gave you. The plates. Is that the partial the, plate? the enameled plate. Yeah, partial the plate. enameled partial plate. It has what? It's fourteen points of 14 armor. Fourteen points. That's it. That's it. That's it, you little ingrate. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Just checking. Uh-huh. That's all. Where can I put those two points? Just Anywhere you want. You can put them in your attributes. You can put them you in passions, in traits, yeah, skills. Not in stats. No, you, you no, don't you have glory have points. Like glory, oh, glory yeah. bonus points? You can yeah. break you the can, rules. You can put them into stats. You can put oh. them into a trait that's over 20. Yeah. yeah. Them, you know, oh, they break whatever. all the rules. All the rules. Oh, no. They hang out behind the one in convenience app? store and smoke. Oh, yeah. Out? Absolutely. Oh, okay. Yeah. To, uh, oh, back up to 12. Back up to 12. Oh. Yeah. yeah. All right, then. Yes, bonus points are a good way to fight the effects of aging. Yes. Indeed. Oh, awesome. And, um... So can I push horsemanship up to 21? Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> I mean, unless you want to push your lance up to 18. Or 19? Or 19. Yeah, Even. I would. Yeah, okay. Depends on what you want to do, but. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet, you know. It's oh, yeah, no worries. 21, no, it's kind of cool. Yeah. <laughs> no, <laughs> that number looks neat. Yeah. Not very useful, though. Okay, 19. Two sphere. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. All right, ready to play. Cool. Woo-hoo. All right, well, let's rock. Zip through that layer phase. So, the year is 543, but we're actually going to flash back a Wait, little what? bit. Wait, what? Oh, no. Flashback. Five, to 542. Backdraft. Ah. I mean, flash draft. Whoa, whoa, what the hell? <laughs> flashback. Oh, my God. Back flash. Back flashing oh, draft. Oh, goodness. Back draft. Point break. Right. <laughs> All right. Oh. Mm-hmm. All right, so uh, so we're we're flashing back to that royal funeral. Oh yeah. Late autumn. Mm. Very emo. 542. Yeah. That's right. Gray leaden skies, lowering overhead as mm-hmm. uh, <coughs> as Sir Bore is lowered and put to sleep. Oh God. The the sleep of of ages. Yes. Yes. And so, uh, so yeah, um, you all had observed that the king looks much aggrieved, of right. course, and um, and that this funeral has drawn many knights from all across Britain and beyond. Hmm. Uh, in fact, nearby is someone who is obviously a foreign knight. There he is. Oh yeah. Oh no. Hey. Um. And uh, back. yeah, you can all make intrigue rolls. Actually. Yeah. Ooh. I make mine. Excellent. Fail. Oh, fail. <laughs> okay. Uh, so Leander, yeah, um, uh, Sir Ector, one of your clansmen, uh-huh. you know, just informs you uh, that that's Sir Palamides yeah. Saracen. I've heard of him. Mm-hmm. He's been he's been long from these lands. He has. Uh, he was abroad uh, fighting with uh, Prince Bore, actually. Indeed. So. Wow. Yes. Yeah, so he uh, supposedly he witnessed the manner of the prince's death. Oh dear. Oh. Hopefully hmm. we can find out what it was. Certainly. It'll be the talk of the court. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just not around Arthur. No. No. <laughs> so uh, this is like during the funeral mass. So mm-hmm. um, you know it's going on for a while. Mm-hmm. I always strike up a conversation if you want. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. What's his name again? Palamides. Sir Palamides. Mm-hmm. Okay. He'll sidle up to him. Mm-hmm. Good sir, I heard you were friends of the prince. I was, uh... <laughs> 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 I fought in his service, indeed. Yes, well, it is, um, uh, indicative of your honorable nature that you would come to pay respects. I have to say that uh, <laughs> when I first met the prince, I did not think much of him. But the manner of his death redeemed him. Oh. Oh. Do tell. <clears throat> we were laying siege to uh, a city in Ganis. It was uh, a long siege. We were all rather at a loss for what to do. The prince had uh, taken up the habit of uh, 
riding out um, past the siege works to survey the battlements. Hmm. Um, with a crossbow, taking pot shots at the men on the on the wall. Wow. Wow. Yeah. That's uh. I I elbow Dave. Are you hearing this? <laughs> it's kind of. Uh, eh. Well, they were not nice on the battlements, so True. maybe it doesn't count. Yeah. Using, well, using a crossbow. Such was the prince's way. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. He uh, he always assured his uh, his bodyguard that he was riding far enough out that no arrow could strike him in return. But uh, uh, that one sad day, he was proved wrong. Oh my god! And the arrow arced out from the wall and struck him square in the neck. Oh, man! Well, it's funny how things work out sometimes. For the prince's wounding did more to motivate our men than any great speech or uh, offer of reward that so far induced them. And uh, fueled by rage and led by Sir Bleobaris, they stormed the castle walls and took the town. Wow. I was there in the prince's tent as he lay dying, and the archer who fired the fatal shot was brought before him. Oh, wow. The prince said, and I remember these words well, It was a good shot. I shall forgive you and spare you. After I die, release this man. Oh. Sir Bleobaris gave his word, and the archer wept with joy, dropping to his knees and praying for the prince's soul on the spot. The prince, with a hint of a smile on his face, then expired. Wow. At that point, Sir Bleobaris ordered the archer to be taken away and tortured to death. Oh, wait, what? Are you whoa. serious? Oh, shit. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Snap! <laughs> um. Oh, man. That's. Uh, yeah, and Palamides looks very grim as he relates that part of the yeah. story. Yeah. Where is that knight now? Blade of Bloodies. Sir Bleobaris? Yeah. Yeah. He's one of your kinsmen, actually. Is he? He's, he's at the Ganis Knight. Is Mm-hmm. Mm. <laughs> I'm much, I'm I have to back my cousin's No, play. I do not <laughs> necessarily. Yeah. I'm much aggrieved. Yeah. Especially since the prince ordered him to do that. I don't know why he got carried away. Well, what's your cousin like? He's a douche. Like me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, like all Deganus knights, he's a douche. <laughs> We're proud of it. However, the order of the prince was to be honored and... The fact that it wasn't is worrisome to me because his last wish was not fulfilled. So the was the man was the was the um what was it? The arrow guy? The shooter. The, shooter. the archer. The, the archer. archer. Jesus Christ. The archer. Was the archer killed? I mean he was tortured yes, to death. He was tortured to death. Skinned alive. Oh. Oy. That's horrifying. I mean it's yeah, horrifying. It's typical, <laughs> it's typical but it's, like, it's horrifying that the prince's last wishes weren't honored by my cousin. Mm, that's more important. This is yeah. angering me because he's doing a disservice <laughs> to our. Plus, that castle's totally gonna get haunted by a skinless ghost now. Yeah, bastard. Uh, <laughs> Damn it! You have to show up in like 300 years with a Call of Cthulhu team. <laughs> really, <laughs> with the Venture Brothers. Out. Yeah, jotting down notes. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Seems like a venture quest. All right, yeah. so um, I think I need to go talk to my cousin. Mm. Is he at the funeral? Certainly. Uh, he may may well be. Yes. I need to find out if he's around because I'm gonna challenge him to something because this is ridiculous. Where is he? He's really getting me upset. I think another intrigue roll would do it. I don't. I don't know why I'm so upset, but I am. I make it. It's okay. your family's honor. Yeah. It is. My honor is 19. It went up by one this year. So, yeah. Oh, man. I'm a little pissed. Oh. Yeah. He's going down. Hmm. I don't want to have to kill one of my own kinsmen, but he's acting out. Compl- I have to find out why he did that. Because maybe the archer said something really <laughs> snotty. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you can't kill me. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Um, I'm grasping at straws right now because you're not saying anything. All right. So, you, you find you find him. 
amongst okay. the crowd. As after after the uh, funeral wraps, you know, mm -hmm. people are breaking up and okay. riding off. So. What is the meaning of this story, cousin? <clears throat> so you related to him. Uh -huh. Well, the prince was not in his right mind. This is a lowly, a lowly villain who has slain one of the flowers of British chivalry. Come now, what would you have done? I would have obeyed the prince's last wishes, no matter how addled he was. Because when word gets back that you did that, the way that it comes across is terrible. You he weren't there. No, I wasn't there. He had an arrow sticking out of the side of his neck. I've seen worse. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> <laughs> it's truth. That's no. <laughs> There's no excuse for dishonoring or not honoring the last wishes of the prince. And you come out and go against his wishes? Unbelievable. It's a disgrace. And it makes the Daganis look horrible. Not that we need any help, but <laughs> <laughs> it makes us look terrible. So people are starting to look, you know, Good. starting to mm -hmm. turn their heads. Pretty here. Mm-hmm. Ooh, let's see how he feels about all this. How proud is he? You need to tell the only reason he's proud, prideful is me. It's a mess. Well, I'm only 15, but still. Pride versus Whoa. pride. Mm -hmm. Yeah, really. Uh, rolls modest. No. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Proud. Yes. Mm -hmm. All right. I think you forget yourself, cousin. <gasps> Ooh. Just like you forgot the last wishes of the prince. Ooh, oh snap! <laughs> so he's uh, he's kind of trembling. He should be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> With <You're> anger. <laughs> oh no, but fear. <laughs> I do not wish to challenge you on the field. For I would hate to spill the blood of my own kinsmen. Oh, I have absolutely no qualms doing that. So <laughs> let's do this. Instead, I propose a quest. Um. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> <laughs> that old woman was right. <laughs> yeah, instead I propose a pilgrimage. I just I went to the old woman to get a cure for my constant erection problem. Right. <laughs> she <laughs> gives me a prophecy instead. Me quick, one slow. <laughs> No, that's not a problem no, at all, no, but no. anyway. <laughs> so, I can, assure you. I can assure you. No, like, what the hell? Where? What? What is it? Why do you, why are you, how is a quest a challenge? To the north. Tucked away in the forested mountains of Cumbria. There I is, know it. I know. I've been there. There is a small kingdom. Okay. Another as, one? Known as the Kingdom of the Circle of Gold. Since time immemorial, a gold circle has stood from a pole in the center of the town of the same name. Knights have repeatedly attempted this quest to attain the circle of gold and have failed. I propose that you and I, in our own time and manner, attempt this quest. And if one of us can achieve the quest before the other, then he will be considered in the right. Neither of us achieves the quest, then we will forget the whole matter. I don't want to forget it. This, this is a distraction from what actually happened. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Look over here. <laughs> I'm going to counter your offer and say that whatever the consequences in this, the king, this kingdom are, mm. because it sounds to me like there's some magic at hand. Sure. I'm sure you will suffer the consequences if you succeed or fail. And I don't know if I'm willing to put myself out on a limb for that. How about a forgiving, vengeful role? Yeah. Mm. Perhaps modified by love of family. Mm. How much do you love your family? Fifteen. Mm. Roll that passion. Mm. I fail. Ooh. Ooh! So minus five to your forgiving. No, I don't think you have to. I don't have to put it down right away if I fail. Well, no, because you weren't you weren't rolling it to oh, modify anything. Oh, sorry. Like, so. I kind of wanted yeah. to do that. Like, you wanted, you wanted your loan family to go yeah, down. Yeah, I did. Oh. Okay. Well, minus okay. Five well if you kill him, I'm sure. So minus five, five to my <laughs> yeah, exactly. So minus five to forgiving okay. plus five to vengeful. Okay. Um, just for the roll. My forgiving is five. Really? Oh. So it's zero. You're a vengeful no. motherfucker. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, then, so roll that vengeful. And then plus five to my. Yes. You're already fifteen vengeful. Fourteen. I make it. Yeah. Sounds like you want like resolution right now. I do. Satisfaction. I yeah. do. Okay. Very well. Yeah. Very well. 
So, uh, Blue Barris, um, ascents, but does not like it one bit. Is he on the round table? No. Ah. Yeah, whatever. He's, he's lower class. I just family. can't believe that he did this. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Me look bad. What? Yes, he is. Oh. Oh, yes, he is. So, actually, you're both round table knights. You can't fight each other. Oh. oh, that's why. He oh, so that's why you brought up the quest. Yeah. Yeah. The quest. The quest. Okay, well, <laughs> let me bring my let me bring my bros with me. I mean, my bro, Day. <laughs> and our other bro. And our yeah. new bro, yeah. Jason. I, I didn't realize that I met I met you at the yeah. funeral. Yeah, I met you. At the, mm-hmm. Sorry about your loss. <laughs> oh my god. Um, <laughs> okay. do, you want, do you want to come on a quest with me? <laughs> Don't you trust with us? With us. Quest with oh us. yes, so yes, with us, with us. Two of you, okay. Yes, both of us. <laughs> um and yeah, so so circle of gold kingdom. I haven't heard of that quest. Me mm-hmm. neither. Mm-hmm. Have you heard about this? And I've heard um I've heard some stories. Uh, there's also, um, I believe, a, uh, a residence in uh, Count Kinren's uh, domain who used to uh, be a knight of the Circle Ooh. of Gold. Oh, yes. So if we want to make a, a side trip to where? Ridichan? Ridichan. Yeah, to check it out. Maybe Perhaps we, we should. Perhaps we could get some inside information. That's a great idea. Yeah. All right, let's all go with my reprobate cousin here. <laughs> Is he going to come with? No, like, he's going separately with his own bros. <laughs> so. What's the point of this? I thought we were supposed to bond and make peace with each other as we went on this quest together. No. It's basically who gets to the quest, who gets to the circle of gold fastest. Exactly. Amazing. Well, I think more information, inside information. The Amazing Race, Pendragon Edition. <laughs> 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 yes, so that does bring up a logistical issue. If you stop off in Oxford first, he might get there first. Whatever. He's going to get killed way before that. So he's going to get crushed or eaten by something. All right. <laughs> Wow. Uh, sure. So you buy some random bear or yeah. boar. <laughs> yeah. Who knows? <laughs> bear or boar. <laughs> so um, let's go to Oxford and check it out. All right. Hmm. All right. Okay. Unless you don't want to, you don't have to. No. No, I'm always interested in hearing yeah. more about uh, this kingdom, the areas, and things that I could write songs about. That's true. Because, honestly, my material's getting a little stale. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, and one more round of uh, Intrigue Rules before Ooh, you... Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I make it. I fail it. Fail. Oh, fumble. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Wow, <laughs> you're just paying attention to something else. Yeah. Exactly. Mm-hmm. All right, so, Leander, you um, also hear some chitter-chatter about the fact that uh, the king's other son, Sir Loholt, was not present at this funeral. <gasps> Ooh. That's strange. Wow. Mm-hmm. What do I do with that information? Loholt? Loholt. Loholt. Okay. Loholt. All right, well, that's strange. That is very... Maybe he's on a quest of his own? His mm-hmm. Maybe Half he's lost brothers. in the Forest of Ash. Ah. Mm-hmm. All right. Maybe he's mad. Mm, that would be bad. Yeah. You don't know how mad I've ever been. Yeah. Hmm. You know, speaking of that, another round of intrigue rolls. <laughs> <laughs> We're all mad here. I make I, it. I make it for once. Oh, gee, I'm just like hot on the intrigue. I know you are. Oh. Um, yeah, speaking of mad knights, um, Sir Tristram. Mm-hmm. Apparently, um, <clears throat> there's some, some to do with him in Cornwall last year and he ran off howling into the wilderness. <gasps> oh so nobody really knows what that what that involved. All right then. Mm-hmm. Well maybe we'll find him. Yeah. 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 Who knows? Yeah. He'll be in a tree somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He thinks he's a bird. No. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, off you go. Yeah. Destination Oxford, eh? Hmm. Yes. Okay. Are we now in the year 543? We are in 543. So it's spring of 543 as you depart for Oxford. I'm Ooh. just muttering under my breath the whole time about my cousin being just such a... Anyway, this will be exciting. It's a good thing. I'm trying to be more positive in my life. I'm probably not shutting up about the rat. <laughs> That's true. Oh, yeah. So hey, think oh, of all God. the material you're gonna a get. More of twenty-eight. Yeah. Yeah. 
forget it. You've, you've done many yeah. songs. You have a couple volumes already dedicated to her. Yes, mm-hmm. indeed. I need to learn how to write so that I can uh, yeah. actually jot these down. Right. Not just from mm-hmm. memory. Mm-hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't help you there. Um, I don't think. Let's see. Would Venery co- be like writing? Um, I don't know. What does it cover? Let's see. Venery. Does it cover read Latin? Yeah. But I only have a two. So. Well, no, it's whatever your beanery is. Oh, then it's 13. I can teach you how to write. Oh, man. Latin. Ooh. Mm. I don't know if that would be good, though. It's true. A pursuit of non nightly tasks will mm. only weaken us in the end, won't it? Ultimately, yes, but, you know. But I love her so much. How many more years do we have? <laughs> Come on. And there's, you know, there's no more wars. There's no more Saxons. And there's stuff to make life worth living. Saxons are friendly now. Uh, well. For yeah. the most part. What do you think of that, Tathan? Saxons are friendly now, don't you think? Yeah, they're worthless. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> whoa, hey-o. We got a Saxon hater over here. <laughs> there was another Tathan who felt much the same way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, Venery only covers flirting and romance. Oh. What? Mm. Yeah. Okay, sorry, I can't help you there. It's okay, I'll just continue with the oral tradition. Yes. Well, all right. I hope you're not sick of songs about Lorette, because this seems to be the only thing we're going to be listening to for a while. <laughs> <laughs> At least they're catchy. <laughs> they are <Yeah>. pretty catchy. <laughs> they're earworms. Ah. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Who would have thought so many words could rhyme with Lorette? <laughs> <laughs> Florette, duet, uh, other um, ones. Baguette. <laughs> Baguette. <laughs> <laughs> Lancet. Lancet. <laughs> what else? Uh, sunset. Oh, we met. Well met. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yes. Wow, there's a lot going on here. All right. Forget. Oh, regret. Forget. Yep. Regret. I can never forget the sunset where I met Lorette. Mm. <laughs> so many regrets. No regrets. No regrets. Oh. <laughs> I'll bet. Oh, man. Oh, man. It goes on like this. <laughs> All right. Are we in Oxford yet? Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. Are we there yet? Yeah. <laughs> mm. womp, womp, womp. Yes. So you arrive at Oxford uh, amidst a cold spring downpour. And, of course, are welcomed by Count Kinrain. Oh. Mm-hmm. How much gout has he experienced over the course of his... Couldn't Senior say. Years. He's, still <laughs> He's still in his prime, according to uh, Jake's <laughs> phenomenal roles for the old guy. Yes, exactly. It's true. Yeah. He's, so he's like quite yeah. a specimen, I'm he, sure. He is. He is. Mm. He's stout so. and hearty. Is glory in like a million now? <laughs> I, think it's, I think it's about three million. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah he like about. radiates. His aura radiates yeah. like glory, like is, waves. Mm. Yeah, do we get glory sustained. by being around him? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Do we get glory <laughs> by just for meeting him? Just for meeting him? Yes, yes. Five points each? No. No? God damn it. Uh, Kinrain, can you can you just rub my child's the top of my child's head, <laughs> Just give him some good luck. There's or a special door that people go through in order for him to like, for them to bask in his presence. <laughs> All right. So does he accept us into? Uh, yes, of course, of course. Are you busy? No, no, no. I'm listening. I'm, I'm okay. multitasking here. So keep going. Oh, okay. So uh, you're doing my taxes right now. <laughs> All right, go on. Count Kinrain. Um, for a while, I I found myself sequestered at Newton Tony where they told me of a knight in your service who uh, was an old companion of yours who had um, lived in the kingdom of the circle of gold and then found himself uh, in a imposed self-exile and where he returned to your lands. And yes. I, I believe he is still uh, living among you at this point, I hope. How old is he? About Ken Rain's age. Oof, uh, uh, so, of course, yes. I think, uh, I think Ken Rain would have put him up in, a in one of the tower rooms. Mm. So, good old Sir Pace. Yes. Sir Pace is no longer pacing. He's bedridden. <gasps> Aww. Oh. oh, man. All right. So, so you all gather at the bedside of Sir mm-hmm. Pace. Mm-hmm. Uh, it, is, uh, it is well furnished. There's a brazier of hot coals to keep him warm. Oh. And a fire oh. in the fireplace to boot. And... Um, Wow. And yeah, so questions for Sir Pace. So what do we need to know about going into this kingdom? Ah, uh, well, he's uh, he's a very old, decrepit man. Poke, poke. Yeah. 
He was not sustained by his glory as oh. Sir Kinran is, so <laughs> he can barely speak Sir. above a whisper. Oh my god. Um, but uh, he says, the kingdom of the circle of gold is is an illusion, and to join them is a curse. Oh, oh no, that's not good. I don't like curses. <laughs> you must to join them. What? You must swear fealty to the uh, to the king in order to attempt to achieve the circle of gold. If I'm not incorrect. No, you're right. You're right. I mean, says some other little voice. <laughs> so we a little fairy. <laughs> Mm-hmm. But the uh, the itch, the attainment of the circle can only be achieved through the grossest form of regicide. Oh, you don't mean Arthur? There is a uh, there is a king who presides over the kingdom oh. of the circle of gold. But that would mean to attain the circle, you must usurp the king. Oh, and risk. Being cursed? Or well, just dying. Or just dying. This <laughs> <laughs> is kind of cursed. He's like, just dying. <laughs> Being right. cursed by death. <laughs> like we all are. Go off on the tangent about death. Yes, yeah, just mutter about death for 15 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> and why would any knight yeah, no even right make mind. the attempt? What's the point? This, <laughs> the sight of all the gold. Hmm. So, if I let my cousin go into this... Excuse me, sir. But So, if I let my cousin me, go... Feel free, to, feel free to think amongst yourselves. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I was once like you. I was oh once a brown man, and then I went mad. Oh my god. <laughs> um, I'm thinking if I just let my cousin get this, um, <laughs> get into the kingdom, he'll be cursed and he'll never... He will have any punishment. He will. Yeah, this sounds pretty bad to me. I don't, I don't see something what the point. point. Yeah. Apart from having given your word. I didn't give him my word. I you just did. said I'll kind of do it. No, you agreed to it. Did so I? you can back out of it, but you'll lose some honor. How much honor? Ah. Breaking Ooh. an oath? Breaking an oath, yeah. Uh, breaking an oath, that's minus three. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh that my that God. That's rough. painful. <laughs> oh, that yeah. hurts. I'm just up to 19. That oh. dropped me from a 19 to a 16. Oh, yeah. And I'm still there. <laughs> no, I'm still there. I haven't recovered. <laughs> it took me forever to get up to 19. Uh-huh. Like, I was at 14 at one point. I so know. I scrambled my way to the top to have some level but is of... Is it worth it? Well, like, well, I, I am 35 years old. I'm kind of thinking about my life and... And your yeah. choices. I don't have any... <laughs> thinking about my life, thinking about my choices. I don't got a lot going on. Well, yeah. you know, perhaps you'll make a better king than the existing king of the Circle of Gold, says Dave. It's so hard to be too characters. Hey, you know what, dude? <laughs> How do I know you're not going to try to go for it? And then you're going to beat me, and then we're going to go on this back and forth thing, just like the sauna fairy lady. Sauna fairy. I was, <laughs> I was a count once. I don't imagine being a king would be any more fun than being a count. Hmm. I don't know. I think you have some capabilities there. But <laughs> there is there is something other else in my future that is that is not the kingdom so you're not going to go after this kingdom I mean, are you future, just accompanying me my future is not circle shaped it is grail shaped at least according to my dreams oh hmm hmm whoa that's pretty deep it's heavy dude that is heavy at least according to the dreams <laughs> How is this turning into like a Call of Cthulhu? Cthulhu, yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like kind of veering in that like certain direction. Yeah, you're being you're being handed your uh, your investigation by an old dying guy in a bed. Yeah, and you're the having skinned, weird prophetic dreams. The skin, the Someone skinned, skinned alive. That's good stuff. Yeah, I think Pace needs to die at the end of this scene. Oh, if he so does, tired. it's all good. Yeah. All right, Aww, then. He dies an old man warm in his bed. That's a, that's a good. Hey. Yeah. It's a nice, nice out. It is. Well, yeah. before all that happens, is there anything else you can let us know? <laughs> before you die. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to die over here. Is there something you'd like to share with us? That Don't get all Yoda on us. Now. Yeah, please. There's another? <laughs> There's another Skywalker. <laughs> <laughs> so is there anything else that you would like us to know about this kingdom before we embark on this quest? It is a kingdom of great magic, and it sits inside. What is, what forest is it? Is it in the Force of Oz? No, it's no, in it's the in it's in the Pennines. That's right. But 
Just, it's, it's magical. It's yeah. a place of. So it's an enchanted magic. valley. Okay. Oh. And the queen's really hot. Yeah. Really? Yes. You had a queen. Oh, she oh. En- enchant you. Oh my goodness. Well, I could use some of that right about now. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right then. We appreciate you taking the time to talk with us through Pace, and mm. we wish you peace and and rest in your final. Two minutes. Two minutes of life. <laughs> <laughs> Two minutes of life. What? What? Um, <laughs> <laughs> prophecy. Um, so wow. Just do you really? Are you really? Bring, bring my bones to Newton, Tony. Oh my God! He just he's dying. Okay, so oh. we need to get. Do we that. like drop to our knees and pray for him? Or? Yeah, what? I think so. Yeah. Let's what's, pray. what's your what's your uh, spiritual or pious? Spiritual. Mm-hmm. My spiritual's up there. It's twelve. Yeah. So I'll pray. And then, and, and then I'm going to get to the point where I'm going to call 911. Uh, <laughs> 12. Yeah, okay. okay. I'll pray and then call 911. 911! Wait, what? What? 911 what? No, uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I'm going to get an attendant. I believe uh, Sir Pace is uh, no more. Inspire. Well, we'll call the priest? Yeah, let's is that priest. a custom? I think that would be good. Mm-hmm. Well, if, if memory serves me correctly, Sir uh, Sir Pace was an unrepentant unre- pagan. I believe he was. Oh. I've got a sheet right here. Yes, he was a pagan. Yeah. 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 Who would, um, Prince. Oh, yes. Mr. Tate was a pagan? My first character. No. Who is that? Kimmer Pagan. Nope. British mm-hmm. Christian. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, Ather. Ather was well, oh, okay. yeah. Or, yeah, yeah. Ather plus Christian. Yeah. Let's get some type of pagan type of person to s- give him a send off here. Yeah. Well, yeah. Perhaps we can have him um, guide his pagan soul encased in the uh, uh, honey to uh, Newton yeah. County. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. So we'll say that. Well, and, and Kinraid's pagan as well, so. Oh. Well, so I, don't, I don't think there's probably a priest in the castle. No. <laughs> yeah, there's probably some ah. druids hanging out. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Oh my god, all these creepy tall, like, like whoa. Blue chair guys. Oh, he's dead. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> I let can me see his R is all gone. Let me get my head together. <laughs> <laughs> so you get my head together. This is too much, man. <laughs> all right, that's it. I'm out of here. Stop living in the past. <laughs> oh <my laughs> God. All right. So, yeah, so he uh, wants to be sent to Newton Tony to be buried. Yes. Yeah, so he's preserved in honey and shipped off to There's Newton Tony. There's a lot Tony. of honey in this land. I know. Yeah. Mm. What, what else are you gonna use it for? Put on toast. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Mickey, comes, it comes out of bees' butts. Oh yeah. You, it does. Yeah, exactly. You are. Yeah, mm-hmm. mead, mead and corpse preservation, the two chief uses of mine. Exactly. <laughs> All right, so, shall we? Okay. Let's. Well, so this is a bewitched kingdom that will more, sh- most, more than surely kill one of us. <laughs> <laughs> and Not it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not it. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Well, hey, if I, let's say if I get the kingdom, I'll be a king, so. That's you true. Can, you could all bow to me, like, you, you should. Bow down. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, this is my humor. It's very um, obnoxious. So, <laughs> um, so we're making our way to Oxford, correct? No, you were in Oxford. We're in oh, Oxford. Shit. We're making our way oh, to, to the, the kingdom, kingdom circle. Go the Pennines. Yes. 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 The Pennines. Mm-hmm. Right. So uh, the location of the kingdom is technically hidden, but at this point the quest is so well known that it's pretty easy to find oh, it. Oh, really? So there's like a trodden path. Yes. Basically, you just have to head up the King's Road into Malahout, turn <laughs> off. That's all. That's all you have to do. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. I don't think any of us are... Uh, oh, wait, no. You're... Uh, Tathan's a Salisbury Knight. Yeah. Mm. Well, Malahout's, uh, well Mal- Malahout's kind of been on better behavior lately ever since the, the King... Uh, spanked him? Kind of, sort of, yeah. Spanked him into place. Exactly. And at the same time, no one named Tathan cut off anyone's arms and... Uh, <laughs> In well, anyway. That was a long time ago. So. That was actually Kinrain. That was Kinrain. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was that was one of the first times we we actually caught a glimpse of uh, what Kinrain was going to become. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Cool. Um very good. So mm. yeah, so it's just a matter of heading up in the Malahau, then taking the track towards Conisboro into Roostock and um then taking a cart path further deeper into the Rostock Forest. Okay. Uh, kind of over, ironically enough, towards the Kingdom of Pace, but spelled with an S, not a C. Oh. So somewhere halfway between Rostock and Pace, a uh, well-worn cart path branches off 
towards the King of the Circle goal. What an omen. We are very, yeah. um, mm-hmm. we are very, uh, yeah, we're looking like badasses. That's right. Entering into this kingdom, right? Um, actually, oh the reaction you get from the local peasants and knights uh, is one of almost um, jaded, you know, acceptance. Oh, really? Like it's, it's, it's it's such an old hat for nice to come and try oh, to circle yeah. gold. But exactly. it's, just it's like, oh, the new, you know, it's like when the tourists show up, the beginning of tourists. Yeah. It's like, mm-hmm. oh, here no, we go. Here You're here for are. Indian market again. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. So, um. So we all have Texas license plates on our. <laughs> <laughs> no horses, yeah. but. Yeah. yeah. Oh, God. Shrug. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just kidding, Texas. We love your dollars. I was cut off by someone from Texas. <laughs> 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 Shut up. Uh, F-U. Uh, F-U. I mean, also like Missouri. I actually see a lot of Missouri plates. And, yeah, and Arkansas. And Arkansas plates. Yeah. I've got to say, you as an, as around a, here, Vermont and Colorado. As an expat, oh. nothing makes me more angry than seeing a bad California driver in New Mexico. I know, it's embarrassing. Mexico. I know. It is. I'm like, damn you, you know better. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> you know better. <laughs> Represent. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. I know. I feel the same way. It's like, damn it. Yep. <laughs> All right. Your parents taught you better, you son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> you went through the California process of driving, yep. learning to drive. All right, so you're following the path. Um, yes. Passing uh, untilled fields, being this early in the year. Oh, yeah. Um, before entering into a denser part of the forest. Ooh. All right. Uh, kind of passing through a, one of those you know, kind of wooded tunnels with the canopy meeting over the road. Mm-hmm. Ooh, um, lovely. Mm-hmm. Quite picturesque. Mm. Uh, the path is so narrow that you are uh, obligated to ride single file with Ooh. your horses oh, and squires. Wow. Okay. Yep. So you, you make quite a quite a long train. I, I'll just I, I bring this up every once in a while, but just as a reminder, each each night is a minimum of four horses and two people. Yeah. So right. you, you've got like twelve horses in your in your little least. caravan. I at think least. I think Leander's got a few more. Yeah, yeah probably. I got a Being horses, a rich knight. And I have a war pony still. Right. I have four sumters and oh, right see one of my horses died this year, so I'm only down to three horses. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Well, yeah. I have my yeah, I have my destrier, my charger, and my um, I was sumter hmm. and a Ramsey. So a lot of horses. I do four yeah. horses. Did you bring Chef Showtime with you, or of is course I did. Home? So you bought your personal <laughs> Chef. I brought my personal Chef. Chef. Yes, I did. He's riding on one of the horses too. Dude, why do you think I have four sumters, man? I got him and his two chefs. <laughs> 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 Got him in the saucier. That's right. The saucier, yeah. Yes. Come on, man. Okay. How so, we do it? Yeah. No. You know. Any other any other hangers on? Coiffures or? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no. No. Did you bring your professional rack on rack on tour with you to, no, to entertain you? No, I don't have you? any of that. Tell me a story. I love. No, that's what things for. Uh, I like to hear right. stories about Lorette. All right. Very good. Very good. <laughs> that's true. You're both you're both lovers. Yeah. Oh, Lorette, shall I compare you to a sunset? Oh my God. Uh, no, never mind. I, I take back everything I just said. Right. <laughs> Monotone droning is all the rage in the court these days. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. Horrible. Can't stop for rhyming. <laughs> we should uh, double check if you guys are are, are not romantic knights, though, since you both have Oh, um, I am, actually. I'm oh, a yeah. romantic knight. Pretty yeah. sure I'm not. I've got pretty low stats in all my hearts. Let's see. Except so. Oh, you made them hearts? You, you have to have a more or love of 16 or higher. Yeah, I do. And a total of 80. Mm-hmm. From yeah. among chaste, oh. uh, forgiving, generous, honest, wait, arbitrary, wait, wait. and reckless. Wait, 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 go wait, back, go that's, back. That's, that's, that's the romantic different. traits? Wait, what do you have? Uh, forgiving, generous, forgiving, generous, honest, just, merciful, and trusting. Oh, that was it. Yeah, sorry. Wait, what are those other ones? Uh, a, is er, that earlier draft. Oh, earlier okay. draft. <laughs> what draft are you on? Okay, oh, here. Um, so it's, yeah, yeah, thank you. Yeah. And then if you want to put like a little red heart dice to Oh, red, cool. Would you also no like no my next? look at this sheet it's it's <laughs> tear stained and <laughs> Desiree, Desiree's character jacked, sheets so are always it's completely it doesn't deserve it actually oh yeah. but I love mm-hmm. it I love the idea you know it'll make it I'll put that into a possible uh, sheet all right we should uh, we should take notes for uh, future Pendragon character sheets for 
you know, if they ever come out with a set fifth, sixth edition. Yes, if that should ever if happen. If that should ever occur, yes. a sixth edition, they should totally have something like little hearts for uh, romantic yeah. nights. They should. And I should probably calculate. What's, what happens if you're a romantic knight? Just glory? You get uh, 100 glory a year, mm. and then you also get a plus five bonus to any skill use, which yeah. furthers your romance with your amour. Uh. Mm. I can't believe you call them Chef Showtime. Pretty funny. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm six shy. Aww. Uh, oh, what's the total? 80. 80. 80. Oh, okay. And you have to have an amour of 16 or higher. Mm-hmm. Oh. Do you love your wife or have an amour for your love? Wait. Well, um, love cancels yes. out amour. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it has to be amour. Yeah. So you gotta get a mistress. He apparently hasn't seen Guinevere or me? Or? No, I don't think he has. Yeah. No, so. so. oh, at the funeral. He was at the funeral. Oh, yeah, that's right. Guinevere counts as a award, mm-hmm. doesn't she? She, she would, would, yes, for absolutely. The, uh, romance. Yeah, at the funeral, I suppose so. Yeah. Okay, can I generate that right? Uh, so, yeah. lustful plus ten roll, I believe? Uh, yes, it is. Mm-hmm. So, what's your lustful? Um, it's opposite chaste. Oh. It is six. Okay, so I uh, roll against sixteen. Oh, no. I'm too. Well, I'm too. So you make it. Oh, you made it. Yay. Okay. Yeah. So you'll generate it more. I'm too right. vengeful to be a romantic knight. Mm. So I'm not a romantic knight. Uh, I'm too suspicious. Yeah. And not merciful enough. And not what? Not merciful enough. Mm. That's really s- the suspicious. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, all of mine are pretty high except forgiving. It's. It's a vice. So, uh, 4d6 plus 1. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. 13, 18, oh. 19? Oh! <laughs> wow. Well, uh, so what wow. are your, um, so it's a 19 or more, so... Wow. What's your love of your wife? I don't Do you know, have you a have love wife? I don't have a love wife. Well, okay. that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. So now add up all of your heart's traits. Okay. And if they're 80 or more, you'll be a romantic knight. Whoa! Oh. How funny. That will be awesome. Yeah. Actually. Well, you're well on your way already. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God. Yep. <laughs> oh, my God. Yep, you're going to get it. I think. Oh. No. oh. How short? Like no, 12. Uh, you've got a you've got a similar low spot in trusting. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So. Uh-uh. Yeah. Okay. Oh well, but still, yeah. 19 or more. Yeah. That's, That's uh, that goes in your annual glory because it's 16 or more. Oh. Yeah, it does. Yeah. So that'll okay. count for uh, the na- that's 19 glory a year. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. And yeah, the 80, just FYI, there's only five traits. That's basically just saying, like, you, if you had a 16 in every trait, you get it. So oh, okay. if you don't have a 16 in every trait, then for every point you are below, you'd have to offset it by a point above yeah. in another trait. You know? yeah. Aw, Edie. Yeah. Look at her. She looks well, so it's, it's not five traits, it's six traits. Oh, is it six traits? Yeah. Oh. Her eyes. So that drops it. That, does drop. that drops the requirement quite significantly. <laughs> yes, it does. Charm, little. Oh my goodness. Hey, dog. She's scared of the wind, I think. Yeah, it's not like yeah. All right. Aww. Okay, so, um, very so good. We're making it there. So you're writing in. Into... Which I never like to see. Yes. Because, like, who are they to judge us? We're above them anyway. Oh my god. So, <laughs> proud 17, baby. That's right, baby. Wait, All right. um, no, my, my proud is just 15. Oh, just 15. Just. <laughs> Only a 15. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right. So, um, oh. so yeah. So you're riding through this thick forest tunnel. Wow. Um, the the ground is gradually, gently sloping upwards as you ride single file. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, you departed the last manor that you stayed the night at first thing in the morning, and you've ridden most of the day. Did we want to bring? I mean, no, this is ret- like a lot of retro. Retconning. Retconning. Yeah, but Palamedes. Would he want to come along? He seemed like a good chap. That would be a fair amount of retconning. So, you had, your, you had your chance. Blew I blew it. it. You blew it. Jubbaloney. <laughs> Sir Blood of Lovely. Yep. <laughs> you, were so, you were so pissed off by the I was whole, so mad. I yeah. forgot about Palomides. I really liked him. Mm-hmm. Damn it. Maybe well, we'll find him again someday. If it's a curse, possibly. But if it's a curse thing, I wouldn't want to put that on him. That's true. That's yeah. true. Like, all right, well, so right. occasionally you hear odd rustlings and cries That's from deeper normal. in the forest. That's perfectly normal. Mm-hmm. 
the I scream, tell myself. <laughs> the scream of doves copulating. That kind oh of thing. God, no! <laughs> oh, that's the worst. Don't work that into a song. Are you going to? <laughs> <laughs> this is what it sounds no. like <laughs> when doves cry. God damn it! <laughs> no! <laughs> I can't believe you. I think <laughs> very good. <laughs> so after oh what God. seems like an eternity, yes. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> ah. The uh, oh. the trees abruptly open out, oh. and oh. Uh, you find yourselves you find yourselves at the top of a rise, looking down into a small deep valley. Hmm. Uh, at the far end of the valley is a beautiful city set on a hill. Wow! Surrounding the city are rich farmlands. Mm-hmm. Set at the outer edge of the farms, uh, also occupying a defensible high point, is what appears to be a strong castle. Wow! There is a paved road leading from the castle to the city. An unpaved road leads from the castle deeper into the valley below. The valley itself holds several small villages, gently rolling woodlands, pastures, and a stream. Glints and flashes of light indicate the wooded areas are not entirely free of habitation. Ooh. You may all make awareness rolls. Yeah. All right. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah I know. Oh, oh, I made, made it. Made it. <laughs> I made it too. Made yeah. it. Yeah. You all note an abundance of sheep. Wow. In the valley. Oh god damn. Wow, there's Whoa. a lot more sheep than I first thought. Yeah. Yeah. I'm picturing it like a Catan like It's very Catana. Just all sheep. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah it is. There's like like section there's of sheep. There's no stone or no. There's no bread. No there's no, there's no, no wheat. Just yeah. sheep. No wheat. But it's funny because the valley is kind of shaped like the board, so really? oh, how funny. Yeah. Interesting. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Nothing but sheep. Mm. And then they have all the sheep on the board. You know, that can be pretty awesome. They've got yeah. sheep, they've yeah, got wood, they've they got wheat. Good. They got so they're, good to go. they're right mm. by a dock. Right? No. They're right by the pier? No, no they're not. No, they're not. They're there is a river, but. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh well. Yeah. yeah. It's not a good setup. Yeah. Let's okay, so yeah, that's the. Uh, so we can get new sweaters cool. or uh, oh like yeah, it. yes, yeah. definitely. Mm-hmm. Wool is obviously yeah. a major export here. Yeah. So. It's gonna be pretty cheap here at the source. Yeah, sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So let's. Oh, oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. and Lorette. I wish I had somebody in my life. Oh my god. But you do. <laughs> Ooh. And we're lost. Oh yes, of course. <laughs> oh yeah, we're lost. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had somebody I to ask. <laughs> <laughs> I will find the finest wolf. All right. Wow. All right. So. I blew it. <laughs> you, blew it. you really blew it. Oh man. All right. So um, let's find the king. All right. I guess he would be in the castle. Mm-hmm. Most likely. Mm-hmm. That's where they usually hang out. Mm-hmm. Do you think he's gonna be a bit on the defensive? I think he's gonna be a bit of an asshole. So no, yeah. I'm, I imagine he'll be very friendly. You think? Really? I think so. What makes you say that? Well, if knights are still coming here, it sounds like you know he's not turning them away at the uh, at the gates. So yeah, because maybe he's tired of being king. Hmm. It's possible. Yeah, but that would mean he'd have to die. Exactly. Right. Well, that's from what it sounded like. That's yeah. What it, that's what Sir Pace seemed well, to say in his final moments. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, it's kind of sad actually to think about. I don't want to think about that again. So, yeah. onward to the challenge. Yes, let's go. <laughs> let's uh, sublimate our sadness by interacting with this king and beating his ass. All right. <laughs> We're lying. I'm putting it. So, oh hi. So you head down uh, the trail. Mm-hmm. Uh, it winds its way along the valley floor and through the woods. Uh, as I said, the, the uh, journey is taking you most of the day, and the sun <coughs> is set behind the uh, the hills that surround the valley. Mm. So, Beautiful. although it is still light overhead, you mm-hmm. are riding through shadow. Mm. Mm. Um, and so, as the day draws towards its close, you ride into a wide glen. Uh, it is mm. uh, filled with uh, spring wildflowers and uh, tall, well, somewhat tall grass. Um, hmm. In the center of the glen, where the grasses have been mowed back, is an elegant marble fountain. Ooh. Beyond the fountain uh, is a series of small tents. Um, and oh, so among the tents, knights? yes, and among the tents, you see the an armed knight astride his horse. And Just nearby, knight? squires can be seen arming other knights. Oh wow! And they all make awareness rolls. Yes, oh dear! Yes, yes. They're looking at us. Make it 
Um, I made it too. I yep. crit it. Wow. Oh, oh yeah. Check Dave. your awareness. Yeah. Wow. So, Dave, you notice a, a rider wearing a livery mm. um, galloping briskly away into the woods oh. down the trail towards the east. You're coming from the west. Huh. So someone's coming from the other direction, perhaps. Yeah. Mm. Uh, perhaps we should interact with these knights who are gearing up and see what the, uh, the hubbub Yeah, the hubbub. Yeah, the hubbub. I'm curious about the hubbub. What's their bottle? Mm. <laughs> Indeed. Oh my god. So, uh, yeah, as you ride you guys? <laughs> <laughs> As you ride forward, a squire uh, comes riding towards you. Mm-hmm. He is dressed in homespun clothes and is riding a donkey. Mm. Uh, Aww. Behind yeah, him, quaint. two more squires mm-hmm. trot along on foot, struggling to carry a half dozen jousting lances each. Oh, wow. Oh my. May God bless you, sirs, says the donkey squire. <laughs> Mellow greetings. <laughs> Mellow greetings. <laughs> Mellow. <laughs> my lord sends greetings and a challenge. No one may pass this place without fighting my master for love. Who is um, your lord? Yeah, who is your master? Um. <clears throat> well, he uh, he kind of indicates back towards the tents as he says uh, my master. So. Uh, so what's his name? Yeah, who is this? This would be... Uh, oh, Sir Dorgain, Knight of the Fountain. Oh, oh. what do you look like? We all have to fight him. <laughs> it's too far away to tell. Yeah, oh. <laughs> it's very blurry. He wants to fight us for love. Yes. Is this love some of what? The love of combat. Oh. 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 He's a need for speed. <laughs> boy. Okay. Sorry, oh, I had boy. to say that. Oh boy. So, <laughs> so now. So if we just uh, if we just skirt around your fountain, can we? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it works Can that we way. Uh, avoid your bloodthirsty master? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what say you? There are rules to this quest, good sirs. Which quest is that? What, yeah, what are you talking about? The quest for the circle of gold, for that is oh, why you have all damn. come here. To well, be honest, oh. I haven't come here for that quest. Uh-oh. Very well. If you surrender your weapons, you need not participate in the quest. Uh, no knight surrenders his weapons to an unknown entity. Mm-hmm. It is on our honor, good sir. Is your knight a member of the Circle of Gold? Yes, he is. He's a member? He's a knight for the... The Order of the Circle of Gold. The Order? Uh, oh. So it's like part of their... Right. <laughs> their thing that they so do. Their protocol. We just have to joust. Do we have to win? Yes, you do. In order to The pass. rules are as follows. Oh, yeah, please tell us the rules. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I came here for. I wrote all, all day to see your rules. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, All right. Yes. Yes. This, these are the rules of the challenge. But before I pronounce them, I must ask one last time. Oh no. Uh, any wow. knight who does not wish to participate in the challenge must renounce his weapons. Yeah, we're not going to do that unless I'm not, not going to say, oh. Jason, are you? I mean, right I now? can't. I mean, yeah. can't renounce my weapons. No. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to leave him with him. Could I leave my squire here to hang out with oh, you actually, guys? Let me let me modify my statement. You, guys want to talk you may to you may squire? retain your sword and dagger, but you must surrender all other weapons and armor. your armor. Oh, God. and armor? Mm-hmm. No. Oh my gosh! Hell yeah. no! Do you guys want a squire to talk to? A new guy. He he can entertain you with many stories. His name is Brad. God, you're you're selling Brad. <laughs> <laughs> No, I wouldn't. Um, so basically, I am down. So let's do this. All right. Yes. If it um, depends on my my company here. Leander, you, you first. Perhaps yeah. we uh, <laughs> perhaps we could forge some sort of compromise after you have successfully of defeated I this night. Yes. Ah. Let's go. All right. These are the rules as follows. Yes. Three combats must be undertaken here, Sir Knights. Right. Uh, you will face the defenders of the Circle of Gold. <laughs> Should a single defender find himself unable to continue after after a combat, the honor of defending our king and kingdom will be passed to one of his fellows. Okay. The first is with jousting lances and will continue until one knight or the other is unhorsed. The second two combats are to first blood and no further. The first of these is with sword on horseback. The second combat is on foot. You may use any weapon of your choosing in this encounter. The first one to win two of these encounters will be declared the winner. Should you win here, Sir Knights, you will be permitted to continue on your adventure and will be given directions to your next encounter. Should you lose, your, <laughs> should you lose your shield will be taken and hung upon a tree in the orchard of the Shields of Shame for a year. Yeah, the Shields of Shame. You will have lost the challenge of the Circle of Gold. 
and are forbidden from attempting it again until next next spring. Oh, Should yeah. one of your companions win here, you are permitted to accompany him on his journey, but may not participate in any of the challenges. Should yeah, all that's of the, lucky. Should all of you Fine. lose, you must leave the way you came. Right. I stress again that these combats are for love, Sir Knight, and not for conquest. The victor may make no claim on the arms, armor, or other possessions of the vanquished. Should you lose, Sir Knight, the only thing taken from you will be your shield. These are the rules of the challenge. I have a question. <sighs> yes. <laughs> um, Do we cooperate in these combats, or is it we each have to succeed in three different individual trials? Individual. So nine individual trials, then? Mm. Well, as long as one of you wins. Yeah, once we win, then, then mm. we're done. So can mm. we check out this uh, shame orchard? Yeah. We, we you, you will you will see it uh, on the course of your journey, assuming you pass the challenges. Wow, how many challenges? I just want to see if my cousin's Three. already. Ah. Uh, I want to see if my cousin's already been shamed. Yes. Because once he has, then I'm out of here. Do you also take the name of oh, the yeah. knights that you uh, that your lord has vanquished? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, just the shield. Damn it! Have well, you, seen? you know it. Yeah. What's his herald? Oh, his heraldry. Yeah, you know his heraldry, right? Mm. Yeah, the heraldry. Right, I'm impassioning this with my honor. Ooh. I make it. Mm-hmm. You can do it. What? What are you laughing about? Oh no, wait, do I make it? I do! Yes! Great. Yay! So you describe Sir Bleoberis's. Yeah, it's like this totally like jerk looking guy. <laughs> and then there's like these arrows pointing at his head. It's that. No, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> this, it's this totally douchey color with this totally yeah. douchey terrible, background design. Terrible guy. And it's like most Daganis heraldry <laughs> Wait, has what? the white and red. I uh, know, that's what it said. Yeah. And his has little little designs inside the white stripes. Right. They're, they're stupid designs. <laughs> they're douchey. They're douchey designs. <laughs> they're douche designs. <laughs> the literal douche. It looks like a douche. <laughs> Completely useless. I mean, it's a tool, like, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> it is. He just did it because it would be easy for them to copy. Right. Mm -hmm. So douchey. Yeah. Uh oh. Wait, is the GM getting mad right now? What? No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> so, have you seen this heraldry? No. You don't remember it, but you have a lot of squires here. Can I talk to a couple more squires? <laughs> Can I talk to some of your on foot friends? You yeah. must. You must Don't join a uh, combat in the challenge, or else turn back. There will uh. be time enough for talk after the challenge. Fair I think, enough. I, I will take you up on this. We've exhausted this NPC's yes, we have. dialogue. Yeah, we have. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. All right. Mm -hmm. So. Uh, right, so the Guardian Knight will fight three one on one combats with each challenging knight. I'm challenging Joust, sword on horse, and any weapon on foot. Right. All combats are to first blood with the exception of the initial joust. Jousting lances are used in combat until one of the other knights, one or the other knights is unhorsed. Mm hmm. Uh, only one combat is to take place at a time. Uh, each oh each challenger must take his turn fighting the guardian knight. So yeah, all three of you have to fight the guardian knight <laughs> until the guardian can no longer continue. Well, even if they lose, <coughs> that doesn't mean that they're gonna like if I win. Yes. Or I'm sorry, when I win. Oh, oh yes, of course. Yeah. Um, you Gotta guys can come along up. with me without having to undergo all the ridiculous challenges. We'll still have to surrender our arms. Yes. Oh, okay. really? Mm -hmm. I oh. So. Okay. I feel like I just. Like, just want to leave my squire here with them and then just keep going. Like, it doesn't seem that far to the castle. <laughs> oh god, he's laughing. Wait, no, don't. Sir, did say this is a place of magic. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah. All right, you're jousting. All right, can I use honor? Of course. I'm jousting. I make it. Ten. Okay. All right. Are we ready? Hold on. Uh, okay, he's going to passion as well. He does. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. First Let's love do this. Jousting. I crit. He crits as well. Great. Whoa. So you so each break a lance. D3 damage and break a lance. One. One to you as well. Okay. Wait, that's after armor. Yes. Uh, okay. Alright. Here we go. I make it. Critted. Oh, Okay, he's on a regular charger. So you're on the end illusion. I'm on my destrier. Destrier. Yeah. Right, I have one of those. Oh, that's right. 
Yeah. I do have my charger with me. My Andalusian charger. Just in case All for right. That. 20, so no damage to you, but uh, what's your size? My size is 19. 19, so I'll need a horsemanship roll. Mm. I make it. Okay. Let's do this. 19, so he broke his second lance. But it's only a knockdown. That's true. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. I crit. I did not. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Destry Tables are turned. Is that 76? It's uh, uh, 86. 86 on Destry. Mm-hmm. Holy yeah. moly. Holy moly. Uh, more like unholy moly, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 30. 30. 30? <laughs> 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 mm-hmm. well, Mm-hmm. All right, so his size is 13, so that's an auto knockdown. He's for him. one. Ooh. All right, yeah. All right now Sorry. sword on horseback. Right, so he gets remounted. I have a great sword. Uh, hey, yeah. Sword. Yeah, it's the key word. Okay. It's a great sword. Okay. No, no shield though. Right. And to first blood. So if he tags you first, odds are he's gonna first blood you because you won't be getting a shield yeah, bonus. Yeah, that's two out of three. Fine. True. All right, and I can impassion this. Am I still impassioned? Well, you're impassioned on uh, on the lands, lands but so you'd have to impassion. Have to impassion your great sword. Uh, I use something else. No, you can use honor. I can use honor again. Mm-hmm. Okay, great. I make it. All right. All right. So ten. And he is using his sword. So. Oh, actually, yeah. No, I'm sorry. This is weapon of choice is on foot. Yeah. So this is sword and shield on horseback. Oh, oh that's what yeah. I thought. Okay. okay. So, so that that impassion roll can be for your okay. regular sword. And so okay, so I have ten plus twenty one is thirty one. So uh, plus eleven. Plus eleven is mm-hmm. a crit. Okay. Are you ready? Yep. No. Oh, uh, one away. I make it. You got a nineteen. I got a ten. So nineteen. 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 Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> sorry. No worries. No. Oh wait, what's your sword skill? It's twenty one. Twenty one. Wow. Damn. Nice. Yes. Nice. Yes. He got a nineteen as well. Ooh. Wow. So a, a tie on swords. Yeah. Does that do anything? I don't, I don't think it does. I think so. Yeah, just just the clang. Yeah, because like sword wins against everything else except great sword, which wins against sword. Yeah. So that would have been hilarious if you. Yeah. Would have been. Yeah. He cut his sword in half. Long. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that nothing just happens here. Your hands just go <laughs> numb. Yeah. 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 It's a horrible feeling. All right. Pins and needles. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. So uh, yeah, new one. Okay. A crit. Crit it as well. Mm-hmm. D3 damage. Two. Uh, two to you. Hey, are you just copying me? No. Nope. <laughs> Alright. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Alright. Crit. Crit. <laughs> My god, you guys. One. Two. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Crit. Critted. Boring for everyone. Two points to you. Two to you. Okay. All right. Regular success this time. Really? Mm Mm-hmm. I crit. Nice. All right, go ahead and do uh, double damage. Double damage. Double damage? Double regular damage, yeah. Double regular damage. Yeah. Well, unless unless you want to voluntarily withhold your blow and just do regular damage. But you're trying to first blood. I want to first blood him. Yeah. No, no, I'm all down. I'm always down for double damage. Right. <laughs> exactly. Big guy. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Forty-four. Oof. Whoa. Oh. Uh-huh. What kind of armor are they wearing? Mm-hmm. He's just wearing reinforced chain. Oh. Uh, yeah, they're a little they're a little backwards here, aren't they? <laughs> they are. So that's twenty six. He'd already taken eleven points, so that's thirty seven. Oh dear. Alright, so you kill him. <gasps> oh yeah. Oh no, I didn't mean to. I don't know my own strength. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> so yeah, you uh, you bring your sword down on his collarbone and and just split it open. It's okay. They have rules for this. They do. Really? They bring on the next person. Okay. They do. Yeah. All right. Fair enough. Well, oh well. 
Yeah. So I think that defeats the whole on foot. Well, yeah. Well, plus you won two. So. Yeah. So two out of three. All right, I won. I can pass. Let's go. <laughs> well, they need to do it now. Well, let me just see here. Do they have to fight me now? <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, let's see. So who's the next guy gonna be? <laughs> Uh, I'm waiting for this all day. Okay. Okay, so you get... There we go. <laughs> uh, there's one the less guy. knight of the circle of gold. Yeah. I oh, killed, I killed right. one of my future knights. Yeah. Uh, you know, you, they gotta, you gotta make openings. That's right. Yeah. yeah. You guys wanna join the team? You're more than welcome to, so... Wow. Yeah. Mm. It's really exciting. <laughs> so what are you doing? All right. So basically, um, let's see. Okay. Cool. So so basically, um, the squires uh, rush out. There's an old crone who comes with them. Oh no. Oh. Oh. And, uh, and they they you know strip his armor off. And bear him away for some sort of burial. But before they do, they take a gold ring off of his uh, right thumb, mm. and they give it to another knight. Okay. And oh. this knight actually looks kind of excited. Oh. So. Hmm. It's his time to shine. Yes, yeah. exactly. Woo-hoo. He just got field promoted. That's right. That's right. So, who's next? <laughs> Feeling okay. bloodthirsty? Yeah. Sure. Go. Right. Taken. Go. <laughs> Jousting it up. Here we go. All right. All right. Uh, okay. Do you want to impassion? Yes. With uh, arm. Which I, oh my gosh! I great. Yay! Whoa! <laughs> oh, so your honor, your honor immediately goes up by one, and you oh. check it, and you so get. So now a, it's twenty, though. Okay, great. Wow! Yeah. Yeah. And you get a plus twenty to your spear expertise <laughs> for yeah. this joust. Did so cool! Oh my God! <laughs> and All your right. spear expertise is at twenty, is it? Yeah. Oh, it's at 19. 19. Remember, because I moved okay. the other two it's apps. 29. So it's still an auto crit. Oh, right? yes, so 39. Crit. 39. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's yep. sweet. So yeah. Really cool. We'll Love see it. how high you crit. Yeah. Basically, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Pretty much. Eight, so, yeah, that's a 37. Yeah. <laughs> 27. Nice. Nice. Good job. Okay. Yeah. I also critted, Nothing. so that's uh, D3 damage ah, to each yeah. other. Okay. Mm-hmm. What? Uh, two. Two. Okay. Uh, one point. Okay, and you take two. All right. Okay. All right. Wow. Circle back around for another pass. I love it. For okay. another crit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's fine. So little less this time, but I got a mere nineteen. So mm-hmm. go ahead and roll your horse damage. I don't think I have enough dice. Oh my god. Do you want some? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Short two. Seven here. Mm-hmm. No. <laughs> oh, oh hey all right. Up. Okay. Uh, I saw one somewhere. Two, two lines. Ten. Mm, Twenty. Eight. Twenty-nine. Twenty-nine. Okay. Yeah. It's not double duster damage, right? No. It's no. just regular no. duster damage. Okay. All right. Well, twenty-nine is still double his size, <laughs> so right. that's an auto knockdown. Yeah. Good job. Some damage Very from good. the fall, and at least he's still alive. Uh, okay. <laughs> so next is uh, sword and sword, shield, sword on, shield horse? on horseback. Okay. So you can impassion again, but it would have to be a separate passion roll. Okay. You're still critically passioned on your spear expertise, though. Okay. Just um, so you can still use honor again if you want. Uh-huh. So mm-hmm. Oh, passion your sword. One. Yeah. yeah. I'll do that. Okay. Well, I um, did I just add that one point? Like automatically, yeah. Yes. The yes. So it's twenty. 20. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So now it's impossible to fail your honor rolls. <laughs> right. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Well, nice. I made it. Woohoo! Yeah. Still roll to see if you ever crit your honor. Yes. Yeah. Because yeah. then, oh, then it continues to go up. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Yeah, I can. Really? That's yeah. How, oh yeah. That's wow. how you end up with a twenty-eight. You know. Yeah. Oh right. Yeah. 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 <laughs> and it just turns into this. It, it turns into a falling kind it of does. thing. Yeah. 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 Okay, very good. So uh, let me impassion him. He makes it. Okay, so here we go. Right. Sword. Sword. First blood. Right. Uh, 18 for me. Seven. Seven? Okay. 
So damage. Let's see. What's his damage? Forty-six. Um, thirteen. So that's not going to get through your armor. Ah, okay. Okay. New round. Twelve. I got a sixteen. Oh, oh, well, you're impassioned, right? Oh, right. 10, 22. Roll yeah, right. So, yeah, 22. 22. All oh, right. Um, so, so last time it would have been... What's your current sword? Oh, is that 16? 16. So 16 becomes 26. So you add 6 to everything you roll. Okay. So 12 becomes 18. 18. And I got a 16. Oh, 16. Yep. So, yeah, so you got it. You got so it. go ahead and roll your damage. Okay. Your regular damage. Are you 5d6? Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. So, there you go. Mm-hmm. Oh. oh yeah. Yikes. Five, six, seven, ten. Ten. Oh, oh man. Yeah. yeah. All right. New round. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Eight. So that's fourteen. And I got a ten. So all right. So all your all right. five to okay. six again. Better. There you go. Yeah. Like that it. looks like first blood. 16, 24. Mm-hmm. You got it. First Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so that's two out of three. three. Alright, so dig. Dig. Alright. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. Alright. Uh, Honor. Uh, yep, yeah, sure. Oh. Crit. Wow. <laughs> I wish I could have like taken video of that. Yeah, like, that was actually, it just rolled under yeah, yeah, yeah. It actually <laughs> rolled and then like hit my dice uh, box which has like some rubber bands on it, so uh-huh. it started doing like this spinny thing. Yeah. And then drops on the cool. table with a sixteen. Nice. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. So awesome. crit my honor. Okay. Wow. Okay. All right. So, so cool. all right, so thirty six lance. Uh huh. I'll uh, crit on anything over a four. Great. Mm-hmm. Right. Uh, crit. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Regular success for me. Okay. So that's regular horse damage. Wow, that's a lot of ones. Uh-huh. Oh. Three, six, ten, and then four ones. <laughs> Fourteen. Fourteen. Yeah. Well, his size is thirteen, so... So at least oh. there's a chance you could knock it off. <laughs> <laughs> and you do! Oh my god! Oh. Like a glancing blow. Yeah, <laughs> Basically, uh, yeah. it's like you're kind of riding by, and then you, you kind of just, uh, like, <laughs> 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 I, think, I think he's a little gun It's like, it's like Ren Faire jousting, you know? Yeah. Like, uh, uh. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think he also got, like, clocked by. Yeah, he's still, That's like, true. He's maybe yeah. still reeling like, a little bit. Yeah. 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 All right. Mm-hmm. All right. So that's the joust. Indeed. Okay. Sword and shield. Sword and shield. Okay. Hmm. You think I could roll Amage Arthur for this? Because, I mean, he wants us to go on adventures every year, right? Yeah, that's true. An he, he has specifically said questing is the noblest thing knights could be doing right now. So, so oh. honoring him in this mm-hmm. with my sword. Okay. Definitely. Okay, I make that. And then. Ooh, let's see if I love my family, because if I roll a one, this will be funny. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The, your magic sword. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love my family, so. Okay. Plus three, I believe, to sword, uh-huh. which is 14 becomes 24. All right, so I'll crit on 16 or higher. All right. I roll a seven. I got a nine. All right. Mm. Mm. Uh, 17. I don't think that's going to do it. That won't break oh. my armor. Is that, is that going to force a horsemanship roll, though? <clears throat> oh, um, 17 will force a horsemanship roll. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I have a horsemanship of 20. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. So I make it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so I like, oh, okay. Okay. All right. New round. I crit exactly. I, I crit Yay. as well. Awesome. Oh. So D3. Yeah. So you take three. And you also take three. Okay. Oh. Can I get through a session where I don't kill a guy? Ah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> only a session. Only a 19 for me. Uh, yeah, that beats my 6. Okay. Hmm. Ooh. 10, 13. Oh my god. <laughs> what in the world? One. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think that'll do it. No. Mm-mm. No. All right. Cool. Uh, 16. 12. All right. Oh, that's 
slightly better, I think. That's uh, 11. Yeah, 18. Okay. 18 is good enough. Well, no, wait. No, that's exactly his shield plus uh, that, armor. Right, so, so uh, not no. quite. Let me see if you knock him off his horse, at least. You do. Oh, oh so. Good. But, I mean, you know, he yeah. just gets back up. He yeah. He's held. Squire's yeah. held. But, you know, he took some damage. Yeah. Right. It's important. Uh, another 16. Uh, 13. Okay. Uh, yeah, don't break his armor. <laughs> mm. Higher than 13 damage? Uh, well, he did he fail? Because if he didn't fail, then it's, uh, it's an 18 that I gotta break. Oh, you mean for knockdown? Yeah. Uh, 9. Uh, yes, I got a. I, no, I got 13 exactly. Oh, okay. Yeah. Alright. Here we go. Okay. New round. Wow, that's just. <laughs> This is just on, like on and on. Yeah. Uh, that's a 14. Oh, I got a 10. <laughs> <laughs> just keeps handing it to you on a silver platter, man. Uh-huh. He's just oh, waiting for you. Oh, okay. Um, so that's 12, 17, uh, 19, 21. Perfect. All right. Okay. Take three more points of damage and concedes. Well, just kind of glad I didn't kill him. Maybe I was like subconsciously well. pulling my punches. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want him to bring like a complete no. greenie out for the next guy. Uh. Oh. All right. So, uh, so yeah, you are. Let's see. You are welcome to stay at the camp tonight. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, this knight uh, identifies himself as the fourth son of Baron Brangus okay. of the Castle of the Circle of Gold, and uh, goes on to introduce all the other knights. You notice everyone here is young. They're all newly knighted oh, knights. Man. And the crone he introduces as <laughs> the crone he introduces as Colette. All right. Um, we are all uh, on bivouac here to learn the hardy task of defending our kingdom. Ah. Huh. Sorry, Sorry. about your friend. Yeah. Casualties of war. But we're not at war. war. <laughs> <laughs> accidents accidents happen even in training. Uh. Okay. We're at war with you. Well, <laughs> We are just training to, to uh, be defenders of our kingdom should war come to us. I see. All right, that makes more sense. Mm-hmm. Well, if I may offer a suggestion, perhaps a little bit more courtesy to incoming knights would avoid situations like the one that just happened. <laughs> but that's what we're here for. Well, you, you still show respect to your foe even in war. That's, that's Did we not show you respect? You could have met with us a little bit more. We are here to defend our borders and to offer a challenge to any who might penetrate them. But we just did, and you're fine with it. Yeah. Quite so. <laughs> All right, then. This is creepy. We're in a so as, uh, as, as, <laughs> as you're talking, you know, they're, they're laying out food and drink. Uh, right. It's simple, simple fare like you'd find on the campaign, you know, a, hmm. a stew and salt bacon and uh, hmm. beer, you know. All so, right. Well, well okay. Dig in. Yeah, mm-hmm. So, where do we go from here? Will they tell us in the morning? We will tell you right now. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Um, so, yes, he, uh, he tells you uh, that you just continue down the road oh, a ways. Mm-hmm. And uh, let's see here. Hmm. Anything specifically... Mm. Yeah, just continue down the road, down the road a spell, and you'll uh, you'll encounter the next challenge. Down the road well, a spell. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, shall we? Yeah, uh, yeah. Or is so it getting too late? Well, you can you can rest the night. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's sleep the night and get off early in the morning. Yes. Anyone wounded? Uh, yeah. Do we hear? Yeah, yeah. Can we? Well, you can have ah, your, your squires day. tend to, yeah. or Colette, the old hag. Mm, this, what are her squires? <laughs> <laughs> I don't How know, you'll uh, find out. Uh, mm. I'll trust my squire. Yeah, it's okay. Oh, He's a pretty good squire. He'll make it. He made his first aid. So it's a D3. D3? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Of course, just one back. Yeah, yeah point. point. <laughs> wow. All the young knights uh, kind of press you all for stories of, uh, you know, from other lands. Oh really? Around the campfire. Really? Let me uh, let me oh, wow. raise you your ears <laughs> with, ah, ah, <laughs> with a tale of a scion of beauty, and her name is Lorette. Yes. <laughs> a 
tell you a story you'll never forget. <laughs> oh, nice. Hey, that's the fifth stanza. You stop spoiling. <laughs> Don't jump ahead. No. I've heard it so many times. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gonna pass out. I'm gonna yeah, in a coma. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just hit your head a few no, times. Yeah, yeah, exactly. No, I'll tell them. I'll tell them about our various travels and all the different things that we've seen. Hmm. And if only they were able to go and venture into these lands, what's preventing them from doing that? They uh, they serve the the king of the circle of gold and the order of the circle of gold. And he's not interested in con- conquering other lands or or just acquiring more. We're land. having really interesting tournaments in uh, in proper Britain. Yeah, proper proper Britain. Britain. <laughs> correct Britain. In uh, in you know non backwards Britain, Legit. <laughs> <laughs> where we're not expecting to fall into any sort of war because we are in a peacetime, and that yeah. is why we have tournaments, which. Um, might simulate what you're attempting a little bit better because instead of waiting for people to come to you, you could go forth and seek your mm-hmm. own challenges. Ah, uh, but I cannot imagine a life better than one camped out under the stars, mm-hmm. roaring fire at my side. There's a really great you can do That's in other places. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's wood everywhere. Yeah. Master yeah. says if we go outside the woods, we'll die. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, and there it is. Yeah. There it is. There it is. So do all of you have a little gold thumb ring? Oh, yeah. Uh, yes, all symbolize? members of the order uh, wear a gold ring. What Ooh. does it symbolize? <laughs> Thumbs up. Shack yeah, <laughs> So what, is that, what does it symbolize? Um, it, uh, it symbolizes our, um, our commitment to, to the uh, kingdom and to the order. Mm. And it gets removed. You don't get buried with this item that's so dear to you. Indeed. What's so the reasoning behind that? It is to be worn by a knight living to defend the, the order. So when you die, you're not like a member of the Golden Circle anymore? You're dead. But... You Spartan are there fixed numbers God. of you? Or? <laughs> yes, there are only so many rings. Oh. Mm. So How many? As, <laughs> as sad as I was to see Sir Dorgain uh, felled, now I am a member of the Order. Oh, yeah, was his ring okay. still warm when you put it on? Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, my, yes. Oh, my, yes. <laughs> was it still slippery with his blood? That's how you're able to cream it. Wow, that came right off. Yeah. <laughs> All right. No. On that weird note, uh, yeah. um, is there anything you can tell us for the challenges ahead that will assist us in in our quest? No. Are you from here? No. <laughs> yes, yeah. born and born raised, here? of course. I see. Of course. Uh, of course. Of course. Wow. Well. Yeah. My grandfather uh, helped. Uh, well, well. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, my grandfather uh, helped defend the kingdom against the. Uh, uh, some very dark times that occurred. Your grandfather's name Sir Pace. Well, no, Sir Pace. How do you know that name? Oh, we get around. We know people. We know people because we're out in the world. It's yeah. The traitor Sir Pace who brought the oh, no. the dark times to our land. <laughs> so well, well, he's dead now. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't really know him. We knew him for the last uh, 30 minutes of his life. We met so him once. We met him one time, and that was it. Uh, we know yeah. nothing about Sir Pace. Shortly after Sir Pace departed, seven fiends began to terrorize our valley. Seven fiends? What, what, what are they, demons? or? I cannot say. But my grandfather uh, helped conquer and enslave them. Enslave them? So now you have fiends at your beck and call? Yeah. He, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's he, yeah. <laughs> Sounds really <laughs> wrong. That's no, they were, happier. they were, uh, they were imprisoned. Ah, I see. Are they still imprisoned? Yes. Oh. And so. it is said if this land is with, is ever without a king, they shall escape again. Ah. Oh, so Sir Pace was the king. No, but his departure seemed to uh, coincide with their arrival. Well, in, in that case, wouldn't it mean that Sir Pace was keeping the demons at bay until he could no longer? It was the king. What was the king? What? Good King Phalagantus. Who was keeping the demons at bay. keeping the demons? So... What happened to him? He was slain treacherously. By who? By none other than King Arthur. 
Oh, oh yeah, there's that story. Oh, that whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> we know nothing about King Arthur. Oh, who's that? <laughs> we don't know who that is. Who's that amazing man who you're talking about right now? <laughs> He's so amazing. <laughs> who's that amazing sexy man that you're talking about <laughs> right now? <laughs> Yes, actually, Miss Roundtable Knight, go ahead and roll your homage, Arthur. Oh my god, oh, yeah, I don't want to say anything. I think I have to. I make it. The king you're talking about is the rightful king of this land. That's right, the Pendragon, the great Pendragon. And hopefully, with our presence here, we will cleanse this land of this ridiculous king. And the fiends. And this I don't believe any of it. And this terrible slander that you've made against King Arthur, and... Possibly by proxy, Sir Pace. <laughs> ah, maybe. If there's, time. <laughs> if there's time. If there's time. So, yes. That's what I think about your kingdom. Very well. But I'm happy to exploit it for my glory, so... Now give me one of those rings. Yeah, give me... <laughs> <laughs> we want ring now. <laughs> All right. Uh, yes, well, he says, uh, in that case, I certainly wouldn't take the right-hand fork if I were you. Well, I don't believe the word out of your mouth now, but what I am going to say is that we do hope to... I had something really great. I forgot it, though. <laughs> <laughs> Sir Leander didn't get a good night's sleep. <laughs> no, yeah. I didn't. Um, no, but I don't believe a word out of your mouth um, at this point in time. So that's all I'm going to say right now. Fair enough. What's down the right hand fork? Um, treachery and danger. What's down the left hand fork? That's the Goodness path to the, uh, to the further challenges. Ah, okay. Can we, do we believe him? Does he... Mm. You can make trusting, suspicious mm. rolls. No, I'm so trusting! See, how far down the path to the left is the next challenge? How far down? Yes. I feel trusting. A couple hours. Okay. A couple hours. How far down the right path to treachery, danger, and death? <laughs> More than a couple hours. I make my trusting. Uh, that sounds legit. I feel my trusting. <laughs> All right, always suspicious. I, I make my suspicious. coming out of your mouth. <laughs> hmm. No, not you. Nope. Not you there, trusting. Hmm... <laughs> What do you think, Dave? I also feel mm. my suspicious. Something, right. something feels a little off. I don't Ow. think. So we, we've got a truster, check your trusting. Oh. A suspicious person, check your suspicious. Yep. And one who is uh, on the fence. Yeah, good one, I guess. Mm. Mm. You're like, I don't care. It's not my quest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I trust everything he says. Mm. We a point where I can uh, wave my sword around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. That's pretty. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. yeah. Well, on mm. that weird note, um... Let's get some sleep. Yeah, let's, let's yeah. do... I've talked myself out. Yeah. No. I'm all talked out. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Okay. All right. All righty. Should we take watch? Like, okay. I think this is a relatively safe camp. Okay. So we'll, have the, we'll have the squires keep watch. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. They'll have to... Yeah. something they have to learn eventually anyway. Mm. Yes. We should be training the them for hood. The sous yeah. chefs are cool. They're going to cook us a nice meal. <laughs> They're going to slave all night in to fact, make our breakfast. I'm gonna <laughs> 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 They're prepping the oh uh, crepes suzettes as we speak. So. Wow. Yeah, they're pretty great. Marinating. Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> You'll wait for that season. No, uh, oh. no quiche Lorraine. No, not yet. Yeah. Cool. They don't want to like, it's more, of a, it's more of a Sunday brunch meal. Exactly, yeah. 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 No. <clears throat> Yeah. So now what? Morning so comes. Morning comes. You yes. head out. Yes. Okay. So um, you ride along. Um, you're sort of uh, riding through some uh, light woods. Okay. <clears throat> Presently, um, the path kind of wending its way through the woods. Um, after about a half a day's ride. Uh, everyone make awareness rolls. Oh, man. I make it. Make it. I make it. Okay. From off in the woods, you hear a cry of distress followed by a thud. Uh-oh. Is it a male or female voice? Hard to say. Oh. But then a scream of help pierces the air. Oh, that a female voice? Uh, it's clearly not human. <gasps> Ooh. Let's investigate. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah, do we know yeah. where it's coming from? Yes. Easily. All right, so we're gonna go to. I, I would like is to go towards that Which spot. direction Careful. is it coming from? Mm-hmm. Off to your right. Okay. This may be one of the challenges. Uh-oh. Let's be careful. Off to the right. Off to the right. In the woods. 
You can all make Valorous right rolls core. if you'd like. No, 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 no. I make my Valorous, but I'm oh, bravely anyway. choosing to avoid this. <laughs> I uh, fumbled my Valorous. You fumbled your Valorous. <laughs> Check your cowardly. Damn you! <laughs> Alright, I'm not gonna buy this. I'm gonna I'm gonna go I trust what the kid said. We're going on the left side, the left fork. Alright. Right. Okay. I'm avoiding yes. this. Yes, let's go down the left fork. Yeah, no. Alright. <laughs> You've already headed down the left yeah, fork. Yeah. <laughs> yep, I'm already going that way. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Squid no. All right, so you ride on uh, along a twisting path, and, and sure enough, very soon after that that encounter, you reach a fork in the road. <laughs> Lovely. The left path. Uh-huh. Let's go left. Yeah. Okay. Go away it from that wends. horrifying screaming thing. Mm-hmm. And it wends its way through the woods. Okay. La, la, la. So you ride uh, for several more hours. Yes. It is growing dark. Okay, are we going to camp? Yes, you are looking for a place to camp. Uh, the ground is been gradually rising uh, towards the rim of the valley. All right. Uh, the terrain becoming increasingly rough. Mm-hmm. The trees becoming stunted and gnarled. Mm. And the bushes thorny. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He said only right. a couple of hours before we got to yeah, our... Yeah, he lied to us. God what damn it. A lying this bastard. happens to me every time. I always trust someone, and it always comes back to bite me in the butt. Shall we go back <laughs> and make some more openings in the... Uh, the circle, the order of the circle of gold. No, I think so. <laughs> Makes it more open. Yeah, I think well, we should. at this point, it's growing dark, so it's up to you if you want to ride in the darkness. Uh, up ahead, you can see that the path dead ends at a sheer granite mother. rock face. What? Uh, with a single, a single large vertical crack. Oh. The crevice is 25 feet tall at its tip and about 10 feet wide at its base. The crack. Mm-hmm. In the Do granite. We, we have uh, to go through flip. this thing. No, I just sort of paths of the dead style. Yeah, this know? feels wrong. Um, you can ride right into the crack. Um, you notice that the ground of the crevice is strewn with garbage. Okay, so that's a bones, no. animal skins, uh, bits of okay. metal, and clothing. No, turn around, turn around. You can no, all make awareness rolls. Mother. Make it. I make it. I, oh, I crit. I also <laughs> crit. Wow. Oh, yeah. okay. wow. Check your awareness. Thank God you guys already. are here. Jesus. And um, oh. yeah, so so both Dag and uh, Tathan, you notice there is a um, uh, faint breeze wafting in and out of the cave, oh. almost as if it's breathing. No. Is it okay. Stinky. It's a bit. It's a bit. It's a bit. Moist. Um, <laughs> no. <Yeah. laughs> All right, we're turning around. I yeah, know it's dark, but we're turning around. Let's now. at least okay. get back to where the forest looks nice. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. so we're gonna start writing. I think at a pretty good clip. All righty. God damn. It. I'm mad right now. Whatever that little yelp thing. Maybe that was actually a good thing. Perhaps. But it was just so terrifying. It wasn't human. Well, it wasn't human. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. No, I know, I know. Pretty scary. Okay. I will note that at this crevice, mm. at this cliff base, there is another path leading uh, away from it. So, like, if you were coming in from the southwest, this <laughs> one leads to the southeast. All right, let's take that path. The southeast? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well. Are we sure we know where it leads? We don't, but... Anywhere's you know. better than here. Yeah, oh, yeah, let's go. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right. Oh, wait, and there oh, is also shit. a path leading directly east. Directly east? No, we need to go back the way we came, so we have to go south. Southwest, because we came from we came from we the south. We came from the south, west, right? Mm-hmm. We came from mm-hmm. the southwest, so we need to go back to the southwest. South, west. yeah. Remember to make hunting rolls. Oh, man. <laughs> At least it's not a penalty. I fumble. I make it. I succeed. <laughs> Those of you who make it note that the city of the Circle of Gold was due east from you when you entered the valley. Oh, so if we go southeast, we might get to the castle? Mm-hmm. Well, so you came up from the southwest. Okay. There's a trail going southeast and another trail going due east. Let's just go east. Well, well no, I don't know Well, then that. due east would take us to the north of the castle, but if we went southeast... It, yeah, it would probably bring so you out north of the castle. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So let's let's go southeast, and that'll that'll push us towards the castle because we came from the southwest, which means we were heading eastward. And then if we go southeast, that means we're continuing to head eastward, but more towards the castle. Okay, I'm I agree sure. with that. 
with my success in hunting, is that an accurate statement? That is an accurate statement. Okay. Although, since cool. you succeeded hunting, I'll, I'll say that the east path may be a shortcut, but it also may be a long delay. We've already been delayed, and I don't want to... Let's go with logic. Yeah. <laughs> Southeast. Yeah. All right. right. Southeast it is. So how? Uh, so you want to ride for like an hour before you make camp? Yeah, let's yeah. just until it stops being less so thorny. Less okay. freaky. Right. Yeah, a little less thorny. That's all, that's all I'm asking for. Yep, yep, yep. I don't want to roll over on a goat head in my sleep. No, mm-hmm. God yeah. forbid. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah, yeah. very painful. Yeah. Seriously. Okay. Talk, talk about a rude awakening. Oh okay. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you ride uh, southeast and eventually make camp. Hmm. Okay. Got right. the squires with us. Yeah. So we have three squires amongst all of us. So we can take pretty, uh, we can sleep pretty well with yeah. each of us taking a shift. Absolutely. And yeah. Our squires as well. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm-hmm. So um, the next morning, you head out. Continuing down that trail. Mm-hmm. Uh, in due course, it joins another trail, wending its way through the woods. Oh, yeah. uh, so you, it basically just dead ends of that yeah. trail. Mm-hmm. Okay. So there's one path going west and one path going east. Let's go mm-hmm. east. East. Okay. Very good. Yeah. All right. Great. Then we hear a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Fools. <laughs> Okay. So, um, you ride along, and after only about an hour, uh, the forest begins to thin. Mm -hmm. The uh, trail, which has been going up a gentle slope, uh, levels out, and um, you begin to see fields and other signs of civilization. Oh, Uh, nice. mm -hmm. I'm going to find that night. I... uh, yeah. He's, yeah. he's probably right in front of us. We see a bivouac of tents. Yeah. <laughs> and the night looks surprised. There we go. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Um, right. Ahead, you see a village clustered around a small, um, like, timber and plaster church. Mm. Uh, an unwalled but tall and strongly built manor house stands on a nearby hill. Okay. A squire and two armed men carrying bundles of jousting lances are riding towards you. What? Uh, Here we go again. Castle? Are they serious with this shit? Is, mm-hmm. is the castle still in sight? No. Not this oh, this is a new place. But, but we were headed towards the castle. You were? And we could see it before we entered the woods. When you were up on the hill. And had a good view of the valley. Oh, damn it. Maybe... All right. The manor's on a hill, right? Okay, we who are these guys? guys? We could, like, they're look they're bearing jousting lances. Maybe. They obviously want to scrap. All right. Um, Hello. Who are you? <laughs> Do you recognize us? You see a man in livery uh, riding away further east down the uh, trail, by the way. Oh, fuck. All right. Further east. The same guy we saw in livery we before? We east. Oh. Well, we, we were going east. We still are going yeah, east. Yeah, we were going. Yeah, what the hell? All right. Well, who are you guys? Do you recognize us? <coughs> Do we recognize so, them? This uh, this man riding a fine cob. Um, cob? Yes. Like a um, round sea, basically. Okay. Um, he's well dressed with speaks of gray in his hair. Ooh. And there are the men with uh, bundles of jousting lances and stride mules. He says, Sirs, I bring you greetings from the Knight of the Manor. Oh. No one may pass this place without answering the challenge of my master. Yeah, it's yeah. different. And it's he different. repeats the it challenge. Is. It's is the same one? Same one. We is. already did this challenge. We already did this challenge. We're passing through. You must answer to the challenge at each station. Oh, oh, oh so this challenge. is the second station. It's a different yes. one. This oh, is thank the second God. station? Second oh, thank station. God. Okay, and your knight, Lord of the Manor. Your Lord is the knight, a knight of the Circle of Gold. Yes. He's got a little thumb ring. He is the valet nice. of the Circle of Gold. He's the valet. The valet. Who was the one that we fought before? You fought the just a, a just, member of the order. Just the pawn? Just a member yeah. of the you, fought, you fought the pawn. I exactly. killed the pawn? No. S- uh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, then we fought the backup pawn. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. So the understudy pawn. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, yes, this is a new challenge. What, so it's the same challenge, basically. Yes. All right. Same conditions. Okay. Let's do this. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, you can make a heraldry roll at plus one. Ooh. I make it. I fail. Oh, I made it. Yeah. Any crits? Nope. Yeah. All right. So this is clearly a member of the Kingdom of Circle of Gold and the Order of the Circle of Gold. Both? Yes. Ooh. So. All right. All right. So you're going first? 
Okay. So right. this uh, knight rides out onto the road and mm-hmm. will be jousting you down the road. What's right. he wearing? Honor. He is wearing partial plate. Ah, oh, okay. so mm-hmm. that it has cut up. Mm-hmm. Is he riding a destrier? He is riding a, an Andalusian. Uh, All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Difficulty rating is increasing. Exactly. Uh, mm-hmm. Make it. All right. Hold on a second. He critted his passion. Holy shit. All right. Oh, my so God. Oh, no. God damn it. All right. He crits. All right. Mm-hmm. All right. Six. Seven. So, okay, he only critted for lands. You still got sword on Right. Yeah. And, uh, and foot with your team. favorite weapon. Okay, so 27. So your armor plus... Okay, so you take a 7-point wound. And I'll need a horsemanship roll, please. I make horsemanship. Okay. Okay. So he created his passion. This yes, is he like did. ridiculous. I make it. I'm okay. rolling terribly. You critted as well. Are you critted? Oh. And oh no! Just, just yield the joust. Mm-hmm. And then take it up in the uh, horseback sword and shield. Oh yeah, that's a good one. In the sword. Yeah. Twenty-two. So you take two points of damage, and okay. I'll need another horsemanship roll. Just fall off. I make it. <laughs> take, the fall, so take the fall. Take the fall. <laughs> Oh, my, I'm too proud. Oh, you're pretty proud. I'm too yeah. damn proud. Take the ball for the love of your life. Oh my god, I keep rolling the same. This is bullshit. He critted. Switch dice. I did already. already. <laughs> Switch dice. Switch dice. I did. And you're still rolling the same? Yeah. Aw. Meant to be. Yeah. Whatever this is. 29? Oh. So you take a 9 point wound. Alright. Oh my god, Matt, are you, are you still conscious? Um, no. Wait, yes. No. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. No, I am not. All right. So I get ap- knocked out. So after three <laughs> powerful passes... Well, no, no, no. They're not powerful. Yes, they are. No, Because he not. was critting his, his hits. So he's he's hitting you with this, like, Hard. pile driver yeah. of a pass. Well, I'm exhausted. And finally you just in the forest pass there. out. Yeah. Falling from your horse, you take three points of damage. Oh my gosh! Oh. So I'm down to four hit points. All right. So this quest is essentially over for me. You know, according to the rules of hospitality and knight, knightly chivalry, he has to nurse you to health so you can continue the contest. Really? Yes. Mm. Is That's that true? true? Well, he has to nurse you to health. It's your choice whether you want to continue. Actually, yeah, whether you want to continue the contest, because it's only one nothing. Of this exactly. Point. All there's, right. there's no stipulation that we have to take up your arms if you fall. That's it's true. only they have to take up their followers' arms. And I can kick right. his ass at sword any day. Yeah. So, nurse me back to hell, <laughs> you <laughs> son of a bitch. So you took three wounds? <laughs> yeah. All right. I did. Two. Three. All right. Three, four, six. Healed of six points. <laughs> okay, so I'm up to ten hit points now. All right. Mm, that's great. Conscious? Yeah, I'm conscious. Oh, we're going. Oh, yeah, God damn it, I'm here. <laughs> we're in the Pennines. <laughs> we're still, we're still gone east. We're still in the Pennines. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, I still need. Right? You'll need some healing. Yeah. But I let's let's see how your compatriots do. Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And then I think uh, after we've determined this challenge, you guys will be camping out for a couple weeks, right? Uh huh. So we'll we'll uh, leave it off there. We'll pick it up next week. Okay. Indeed. So, let's see how you guys do. Okay. Let's go, let's go. What are you talking about? The, the challenge of Leander hasn't been completed yet, so we're, and we're, since we're not passing through, <laughs> obviously we're going to wait here until our companion is recovered enough. But you can do the challenge and then know whether you're going to pass through or not. Well, if, we're, if Leander's not coming, then we're not going anyway. We're here oh because of him. Oh my god. What is, it, what is this wizardry that he's throwing your way? There is no purpose in continuing on to the Circle of Gold if Leander isn't coming because it's his oath that's driving us here. It makes a lot of sense. Mm. I'm delirious, but this is making sense. <laughs> and if we went on without him, that would essentially be us breaking his oath, which would, I believe, <laughs> violate <laughs> our own oaths to our brother knights. Uh oh. You make an excellent point, sir, says, says the mustachioed <laughs> valet. Oh, he's mustachioed, eh? He introduces himself as Sir Alar. Alar? Please, uh, be, uh, be at home at my manor, and oh, I will, nice. uh, I will see to you yeah. every night. 
We appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that that night he serves a uh, roasted pheasant with honey glaze. Does Ooh. that increase my Ooh. no healing? <laughs> <laughs> it should. <laughs> no. And, uh, no. Okay, and he so tells a tale. He yeah, tells honey, a tale. Hey, honey was you, as Renee pointed out. Honey is used for something there else. Right? Well, that's Ooh. preserving a corpse too. So. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Just one the pheasant corpse. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> they sent Pen- Prince Bore back in a honey glaze. <laughs> <laughs> he was spiral cut. <laughs> no! Oh my god! Oh, Mr. Man. Beast got the same treatment. Yeah, he did. He got yep. spiral cut as well. Oh god, that's so right. disgusting. <laughs> Alright, so he tells a story that night. <laughs> oh. When King Falagantus de la Fontaine was killed at the Battle of Terrabelle, his wife disappeared into the woods. The hot queen, but Pace was talking about. Oh, oh, oh. <clears throat> without telling anyone why she was leaving. You see, she knew he had died, sensed it somehow. It would be months before word reached us from Cameliard. We should have known, though. At the moment of the late king's death, old wildness was loosed and took over to rule the land. Among those terrors unleashed was the invasion of the wild women. Who can say what they were? Various survivors claimed with equal certainty they were fairies, witches, succubae, and crazed farm wives. (laughs) Wait, wait, what? (laughs) <laughs> Depends on who you ask. One of those is not like the others. Yeah, no, they're not. <laughs> Prince Ferion was only 16, but with his childhood companions, he fared out one dark moonless night when no shadows were cast to stalk the wild women in their own domains. Mm. I, a lowly man at arms, was one of his friends. When the giant bat struck... Wait, was, what? What? <laughs> what? I was, for- I was foremost in the fight. I was unwounded by the skeletal warriors that attacked us. <gasps> When the blue woman came among us, I alone would surrender my weapons to her, and in return was granted an unspecified pledge. Uh-oh. Later, when most of our companions were killed or helpless, the blue woman rescued only me. I do not know if she was one of the wild women or not. I freed the prince and his companions. Later, as we continued up the valley, I plunged my spear into a giant toad's heart Wait, what? and slew it but was so burned by its blood that I had to be left behind when the prince moved on. Oh my god. The last of the prince's companions, Sir Dordrakol of Malahout, nephew to the king of that land, was the only one left to accompany the prince. We do not know what deeds they did, but Prince Ferion returned alone. Wow. Ferion went straight to the city, city of the Circle of Gold and took the crown from the treasure room. He summoned the bishop and told him to crown him king. Soon afterward, all creatures that had plagued the kingdom were gone, although I was not sufficiently healed to participate in those adventures. King Ferion rewarded me with a knighthood, this manner, and the title I now bear for my actions that night. I can tell you this much, though. The wild women were not among the creatures that had to be faced by our young king. So they're still out there. The mm. blue woman. The blue woman. So how do you feel about a, a knight named Sir Pace? Chris's name! <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, they say that it was Sir Pace that betrayed our king what? at the Battle of Terrabelle and led to his death. We've only heard of Sir Pace. We've <laughs> <laughs> only heard stories of this story. Wait a minute. Never met him. Wait a minute. <laughs> Aren't you super honest or are you just trusting? I am. I'm just honest. You're I'm not th- super it's honest. It's 13, but uh, it's not like. Anyway, I'm not saying anything. I'm, I'm incapacitated. Right, right. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah. still focused You're, on the giant bat. <laughs> when the giant bats attacked us. What? what? <laughs> I'm scribbling, uh, furiously <laughs> scribbling notes. Yeah. My so giant head. bats, giant toad with burning giant blood. Skeletal warriors. Skeletal warriors. Blue, warriors, blue, warriors, blue, blue woman. Blue woman who Wild women who may or may not be the same as the blue woman. Yeah. Crazed farm wise, the blue woman, was her skin blue? Yes. Like painted, like Scottish. Perhaps. Like, perhaps. Like, it, was, like, it, was it was a night. It was a dark night, so I couldn't dish. tell. Yes. A Pictish woman. Did a Pictish woman paint their bodies? So I started thinking about that for a while. Why did you surrender your weapons to the blue woman? <laughs> she yeah, had, uh, <coughs> she, she said that if I did, I would be granted a boon. Ah. And she gave you that boon. Have you seen her since? No. Hmm. Hmm. Just for, uh, just for artistic shape's sake, would she be considered lovely? Yes. Was I'd she wearing clothes? So. Hmm. Was yes. she wearing clothing that you recognized as clothing? No. She was nude? Her hair was so long it covered most of her body. What color was ah. her hair? Was her hair blue? Uh, no, it was dark, though. It was dark hair. Dark in the were, her, were her eyes, like, glowing? Was she glowing at all? Not unnaturally. Like, emanating so. light? No. Like, her eyes, like, human what eyes. What kind of blue women have you been hanging out with? 
I don't know none. I'm just here. I've never heard of a blue woman. Does she have regular she, she human seemed, eyes? She seemed like a woman, albeit a, a wild and an untamed one, which is why did she, she made. Did she tread the earth yeah. like a woman? Yes, she did. Oh, okay. Hmm. Wow. And the but toad. her hair floated. What color was a toad? Toad color. Was the bat a fruit bat, or was it like a vampire bat? <laughs> <laughs> it, ate our, it ate our faces off like fruit. Good Snyder, you're currently oh married. What? Uh, oh. Currently married. I'm gonna write a love story about him. Yeah. That'll get him a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. No, yeah. he's not, actually. Oh. He's been, I think he's been tiny. Oh, wait. Yes, he is. Yes, oh. he is. Uh-oh. But does he love her? What's his love? Love of 17. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, maybe she's a blue woman. Ooh. What color is she? Yeah. <laughs> what color is she? She's blue. <laughs> uh, I never thought any of you'd ask. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what color are his children? Uh-oh. <laughs> they are light blue. They're, yeah, they're kind of a lavender. <laughs> <laughs> Periwinkle. Periwinkle. Uh, Baby see. blue. Mm-hmm. Baby blue, how dare you? <laughs> All right. So anyway, well, how long do you want to linger at the dude, manor? Dude, like as long as I What's can. Your dealing, I right? am totes malingering. Um, malingering. Uh, four. It's a four. It's a four. Mm-hmm. So and you're how many points down? I'm at ten. I'm thirty points down. You have forty hit points? Yes. Holy shit. I kick ass. Damn. Damn. Why wow. are you talking like I wouldn't even stand <laughs> Why are you talking up like that? Like, oh yeah, because you have a high con and a high size. I have a high con. Of course. <laughs> Duh. Yeah. All right, so uh, so, so you're thirty points down. So I'm gonna try to entertain you know our host yeah. with stories and songs for um, you know four weeks <laughs> for the weeks that three weeks. Gonna, three weeks three weeks three weeks. Well, All right. I mean, how many weeks is how what's your what's your healing rate? Four. Four. So, so four into thirty, so four weeks. Four weeks. Yeah, yeah a month. That makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Dude, I got. I got Since the uh, manor is on a mountain, can we see Ooh, like around? Well, it's not really on a mountain. It's just on a on rise. The hill or so. Mm-hmm. Yeah. How far can we see? Question. You can see. Yeah. Let's see here. I think I need to. You can see to down see. into the far side of the eastern side of the valley, which is like much less wooded, much more uh, covered in fields, and you do see that castle far off in the distance. Oh, okay. So, yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Excellent. And four into thirty actually, it's just it's seven weeks. I seven weeks, right yeah. Like almost stuff. two months. Yeah. That's fine. So uh, you want you want to stay two months? I've so got yeah. I've got a big repertoire. Yeah, dude. And plus he's like yeah, honing his skills. So go him. ahead and restore sixteen hit points because four weeks pass before the next thing happens. Ooh. Oh. So go ahead and restore oh, sixteen oh. hit points. Oh. Oh. And anyone else who's wounded times your oh, healing wow. rate times four and. Awesome. Sort of that many. Yeah. I'm back up to full. Excellent. I think I know this event that's about to happen. You do? Oh, no. <laughs> Someone's cousin is going to show up. Yes, oh, so some more knights bitch. appear outside the manor. Do they do she heraldry? <laughs> They're similar to you. Similar to my own. It's <laughs> 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 yes, eerily similar to your own. Uh, yes, you recognize the arms of Sir Bleobaris, your other cousin, Sir Blaymore. No, are you making up these names? I am not. These are the worst names. All right, I'm going to build you a time machine. You can go back 800 years and tell Chrétien de Troyes that he made up stupid names. Blémo, blah, blah, blah. Hey, Chrétien, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, All right. anyway, so you recognize those two. Okay, uh, so a co- bit. <laughs> you recognize those two and a couple other, you know, like, household knights, right? Wow. And... Oh god, and some familiar arms as well. Oh shit. The arms of Sir Seagrite. Oh what? what's he doing with those guys? We'll have to find he out. Got into the wrong crowd. <laughs> I'm gonna tell him that when he walks in the hall. <laughs> yeah. I'm hanging out with these losers now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Seriously. Alright, and so that's where we'll leave it off. I think the uh, beginning of next session warrants a jacques. <laughs> <laughs> Agreed. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. Mm. That it's cause, only because of Seagret that they got this far. Exactly. Yeah. No, he's the one who... Yeah, but it took them still like two months longer than us no. to get there. And we, uh, and we did a stop off in the in Ritachan. We did, and we got that's lost true. in the forest too. I mean, uh... <laughs> Now we took the Wait shortcut. Yes, that's all right. Right. Yay. Wow. All right. Okay. Sweet. There you go. All right. Well, the last time I so, this adventure, I've, I've forgotten everything at this point. Oh, so good. It's all new to me. Excellent. So no Jen next week either. Um, Jen will be back next she week. She will be back. Okay. So, um, Sir... But, yeah, Sir Perry, who knows Perry, what he's up to. Dude, yeah. I don't know what Perry's doing. What's he's, up with that bro? 
He's, he's already here. He's, he's been here for months. He's, <laughs> <laughs> he's actually king of the he's kingdom. Playing, he's honeymooning in the, in, the, in the forest somewhere. Yeah. Right. Probably, right? <laughs> yes, exactly. Oh, man. Who knows? Who knows what that Perry is up to? Who knows what crazy places we'll find Perry next? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like the idea of him just like appearing out of nowhere. Hey, guys. Yeah. What's up, guys? Yeah.